Hello, hello everybody. How's everybody doing out there today? Happy Friday to everyone or happy early Saturday if that is what it is for you. I hope everyone's doing well. I'm sorry to hear that you're still just okay-ish magic, but I hope you're doing a little bit better. Uh, what screen do I want? I want the chatting screen. Uh... A little still a bit sick and mentally so funky, but a bit better. That's good to hear that you are a bit better. And believe me, I know. I know the feeling mentally. You get in those funks and it sucks. It really does. It really does. I'm glad you're feeling a little bit better, though, in both aspects. I know you've been struggling being sick and also struggling a little bit mentally. So I'm glad it's a little bit better. And I hope it just keeps getting better for you because you are amazing and you know we love you. Let me do this. Oh, wait. No, Brad's here. Brad, please give Magic a shout out if you can hear me. Because <laughs> you're going to beat me to it. <laughs> Hello, Brad. How are you doing? And thank you so much for giving Magic a hug. Oh, there we go. I have my I have Mountain Dew today. Instead of an, anything else. I don't know why I decided to do that. That was what I decided to this morning. But I hope everyone... Nonetheless, it's still having a pretty good Friday and just think it's Friday. It's the weekend We did it. We got through the week might have been a rough week, but we got through it Thank you magic for giving Brad a shout out. I, he might not be home. So Let me do this And thank you so much for giving me what? a shout out as well. I appreciate well, that right. okay. uh, What? We're going to let the clips roll here for a second, and then we'll talk about a little bit what's going on today. I should put that music we were listening to last week on. Or not last week, last stream. Oh my god! Oh my gosh, a Porsche clip even That's popped up! Let's go! <laughs> my cat is climbing all over me right now. She doesn't know what she wants to do. Oh, that's why everybody's hanging around my house. How appropriate that that showed up today on a clip. Oh, double shout out for Hello. Magic. Let's go. A hell of a week. Oh, it's short but an interesting one. I'll put it that way. Oh, look at Online, Hello. offline, wherever. It's just been interesting. In the camera now, now I feel like I'm in the dark and I feel like something's behind me because I keep freaking myself out now. Good going. Are you going to do something, Maddie, or are you just going <laughs> to stand here? <laughs> Oh my god, that scared me. What the fuck is that? Jump, jump scare clips are the best. Oh my god, I totally You need to decide what you want to do, kitty cat. <laughs> you started playing Porsche? Let's go. I love Porsche so much. See why I do I know, I think you've said you've played it before, but how are you enjoying your playthrough currently? An empty shell for people to build in. You can decorate my dick any way you want. Oh, I, I don't think I've ever seen that clip. <laughs> Thank you so much, Brad, for giving me magic a shout out. I highly, I always highly recommend Porsche to anyone. If you guys like Stardew Valley, it's very similar, but it, it's very different at the same time. I highly recommend it. I absolutely love playing it. Yes, it has taken me well over a year to play it here on stream, but I took it at a slow pace when we first started because I just kind of wanted to get used to the game and, and just enjoy the game. I just didn't want it to progress too fast. And uh, yes, it's been like a year okay. later, well over a year later, and we're still playing it, but you know what? I wouldn't change it for anything. I'm really enjoying playing okay. it at a slower pace. However, next week, I think it is Hi. early access. Oh, I was like, I hear someone talking. <laughs> Blossom, hello. Thank you so much, Roger. Oh my God. Magic for giving Blossom a shout out. <laughs> that is the popular clip now. The fang clip always <laughs> pops up now. <laughs> It's the Horde of the Fangs. <laughs> How's everyone doing today? So far, so good. Can't complain. Can't complain. We've, I've had a pretty good day today. Yesterday was interesting for me. I know I kind of forgot to finish my last thing I was talking about, but we're going to go back to that. Yesterday was interesting for me. Uh, left the house to go shopping. Took my mom shopping. Did our stuff. Uh, next town over, literally like five minutes away. Next town over, everything's fine. We get like maybe like five minutes from our house, make a stop real quick, and the place we were stopped at didn't have any power. And so me and my mom were just like, whatever, it's probably the business, whatever. 
And as I'm driving home, my dad texts me and says, uh, the power's out, you might not be able to get into the garage. Luckily for me, I had the garage already open, so it's all good. But uh, yeah, I spent my entire afternoon with no power. So I decided, hey, why not? Let's go outside, do some work. I had some things I needed to do anyway, so it forced me to go outside and do those things. It was nothing, nothing bad. I mean, it was one of those uh, power pull had an issue because a squirrel got onto it. So I spent my entire afternoon outside, and then after I was just like, I'm tired. I'm just going to take my mental day away from the computer and just chill for the rest of the day because I was tired, and then I was just like, I don't even have time to do anything now. So that was my... Thursday. That was my Thursday. Nothing too exciting, but still. I like to take one, one to two, depending on how the week has gone, uh, mental days away from the computer and or the internet. And it, I've found lately that it's really been helping me to either not feel burnt out when it comes to uh, content creating or uh, whatever the case may be. I just feel like if I can take a day or two away and just kind of like spend the time on my own doing, you know, something either around the house or just sitting back watching a movie or whatever. I feel like I'm doing a lot better mentally with doing that. So I, I think I'm going to keep doing that to see if hopefully if it helps in the long run. I don't get burnt out or anything and hopefully keeps me in a headspace that is good for me. So that is what I did yesterday, kind of just chilled, stayed away from the computer as much as I could. I think I got on for a few seconds to check like my email and such. I could do that for my phone, but I also got on for another reason. I don't remember why. <laughs> I literally don't remember why. Oh, I was finishing my YouTube video uh, VOD from Wednesday stream, that's why, because I didn't have time on Wednesday night. <gasps> SK, hello, how are you doing? I did! I did see that TikTok you sent me. Oh my god. I loved it. <laughs> I even I think I, I think I commented back and I said I want. I want cuz I I love it. They're such pretty colors. I don't wear makeup as much as I used to, but I would buy that and wear it for sure. For sure. I got lazy and I don't wear my makeup as much as I should. I shouldn't say should, as much as I would like to. But I loved it. <laughs> well, Blossom saw it too. <laughs> if anyone here in Northern, if anyone in, I've totally messed that up and I can't speak today, I apologize. If anyone here is in Northern Michigan, please stay safe. Yes, I heard there's some nasty storms going around up there. I heard uh, one of my friends from, or someone I follow, from what was it new jersey was having a really nasty storm go through so yes wherever you are if you're having whatever's going on i didn't really look into it stay safe for sure i knew you would like it i loved it i would buy it just for the collect just to have it as a collection piece too because i like to collect things like that and i thought the colors were freaking gorgeous nonetheless and i would totally buy it it would be hard to use to the fact where I'd like to keep it. I'd buy like two. I'd keep one as a pristine collection edition and then I would use the other. <laughs> yes, Blossom did see it. She did. Ooh, was hit by a tornado an hour ago. Very rare for that part of the state. Uh-oh, that's not good. Well, prayers to all of them and hope everyone's staying safe. Like I said, I saw, I don't know where one person was, but somebody said they were having a tornado warning in New Jersey. I think it was New Jersey. So I hope everyone's staying safe. Exactly. It was right before Christmas, so it was a must for sure. I I will buy anything and everything. Nightmare before Christmas. And sometimes with things like that, I will buy a two, one to use, one to keep as a collection piece. Or if it's nothing like you can actually use, I'll buy one. But I do love collecting anything Nightmare Before Christmas. And I actually love, love that you sent that to me because I don't think I would have ever seen it. <laughs> and I loved it. It's so pretty. Like I said, I used to wear uh, I used a sh eyeshadow especially. I freaking loved it. I used to experiment with it all the time. And then since I don't work anymore and I don't go as many places, I kind of got out of it. Because it's like I I'm doing it for absolutely no reason and I just kind of got out of it. Uh, 
All right, uh, let me see what else. Oh, no, I already said that, Never mind. Oh, I thought Blossom saw it too. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I thought she did. Maybe that wasn't, maybe that was a different part of the Discord. Speaking of, if y'all didn't know, we opened the Discord on, when was it, Monday? Holy crap, it was Monday already? Damn, this week did fly by though. On Monday, thank you to my amazing community, y'all helped me hit 600 followers, which was the goal we wanted to hit to open or reopen the Discord. So if you guys are not a part of it, there is the invite link for you all to enjoy. There's a lot of different channels on there, anything from just random, you know, fun little ones like memes and foods and stuff you want to post. Or there's a couple gaming ones as well. Uh, like Animal Crossing and Dead by Daylight, stuff like that. Thank you, Magic. I should have just left it up to you. I, I get so anxious that I do it myself sometimes. <laughs> My mods are here for a reason. I need to ask them to do it, right? That is how it should go. I did see it. <laughs> I thought so, but then I got confused and I was like, wait a minute, maybe that was a different topic. <laughs> wait, I'm in like... I'm in Blossom's Discord, I'm in Magic's Discord, then I have my Discord, and sometimes I get lost where I'm at. I'm, I'm serious. <laughs> I'm like, because we're all in the same Discord, and I'm just like, I'll see it in like Magic's Discord, we'll say, and I'll swear that I'm in mine, and then I'm like, oh, I guess I could post this in mine as well. Whoops. <laughs> Discord party, let's go, yes. Y'all are not in my Discord. I recommend joining, it's a fun time in there. Believe me, it'll get it'll get more active. I promise. It's it's a it's a growing uh, platform for me because I took it away for a while. And now I brought it back, so it is growing. Uh, I was gonna say, darling, how are you, Denny? How are you? <laughs> Do you? I mean, I could call you darling too. That's all right, Maria. Hello. <laughs> I was reading my darlings, and then I was trying to say hello to Denny at the same time. How is everybody doing? Welcome on in if you are just joining. I hope everyone's having a lovely Friday and or Friday night and or Saturday morning, depending, blah, blah, depending on where you're at in the world. I hope you're all doing well. Again, everything good here. No complaints. It's been super windy here. So, okay, just a fair warning. It has been very windy here and so, um, because I live in California, they have a certain thing that sometimes they'll shut off the power like really quickly because something has happened. So if I disappear, it might be because of that. And uh, I might not be back very quick. So if that happens, so sorry, I can't prevent it, but um, it has been very windy here. So that is a thing that could happen. Um, and then when that happens, I absolutely have no service. Like my phone has no service. My internet is completely gone. I cannot really get back on it any way to tell you guys anything because I have no service really where I'm at. So if I ever disappear like on windy days, on bad storm days or whatever, could be I lost power and I will be back as soon as I can. If not, I'll post in the Discord when I can that um, that's what happened and I'll, I will apologize for it. I'm going to give you give a short lurk. Need to fix dinner? No worries, SK. No worries. Go get that dinner. Enjoy whatever it is you're eating. I'm just gonna put stream on my phone. Sounds good to me. Thank you so much for the lurk, SK. And again, hope you have a wonderful dinner and whatever it is that you are currently eating. What is Magic eating? Chips and salsa. <laughs> I know Magic's got that one before. Chips and salsa with a bag of chips. Magic just likes extra chips for her salsa and I don't blame her. I don't blame her one bit. Denny is eating Cereal, ew, cereal with a lot of ranch dressing on top? Oh, no thank you. I'm eating spaghetti with a big soft pretzel. All right, I'll take it. I'll take it. That's not bad. I mean, I don't know if I really would want them together, but you have spaghetti with garlic bread, so why not try pretzel? Maria's having a chocolate chip cookie. Oh, ew, with a side of Brussels sprouts. No, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. I'll take the cookie. I'm not sure that it would go with my Brussels sprout. <laughs> I like how you guys 
guys are all just shouting everybody's names. <laughs> Blossom's just shouts out her own. <laughs> you guys are so awesome. Everyone was saying people's names. I like it. Yeah. <laughs> Magic is just gonna keep going. Just shout everybody's name. Hi, Magic. How's it going? Thank you so much for shouting all the names out. I wasn't done just working. Okay, it's okay. I know you're at work. I I will I will let that slide. It's all good. It's all good. But then again, uh, I do hope everyone is doing amazing today. I'm just scrolling back through chat, making sure I didn't miss something. I saw the food and I got sidetracked. You know, food and me. You see food, you get sidetracked. <laughs> Keep it going, Badger. Keep it going. Shadow all out. Uh, okay. What? Uh, oh, wait. Ah, never mind. It's on my quick thing here. So, today we're playing Porsche. If you guys don't know what Porsche is, cute, like I said, cute game. Um, like Stardew Valley, one of my favorites from last year. We're going to get back to it today. Um, if you have not seen me play from the beginning, every single VOD was uploaded to YouTube. Believe me, it's hours and hours worth. You probably won't want to watch them. But if you ever want to relive a moment, it, it is always up there on YouTube. Um, and that is my playlist for currently Portia that I am playing. I've never restarted or anything. And eventually when we finish, we'll play Sandrock. But because I only play Variety one day a week, it might take us a little bit longer than I would like to get there. But you never know. There might be a day on like a Monday when we play Dead by Daylight that I'm just like... Not in the mood to play Dead by Daylight, so we might play like a chill game, but you never know. But today we're playing Portia, and we're going to be getting back to whatever the hell we were doing. I know we just married Gus, I know that's the thing. My Oreos melted and I'm sad! No! That is the saddest thing ever. Yeah, no. You're a piece of I'm turn. here, I promise. No worries, It's right Dad. there. Oh, right. As if to spite me. Or did you just get <gasps> No! No! Please! Please be a good person! Please! They're so hard! They melted! No! Please! I'm so sad I hate that! <laughs> Please, no! No, no I totally... Not any of my candy, damn it. candy cookies, whatever it is. You fricker, man. You fricker. Damn it. Didn't work at all. Thank you, Magic, for giving... Oh, excuse me. Thank you, Brad, for giving Blossom a shout out, and Magic for giving Brad a shout out. I did. Oh, that's one of Brad's new ones. Let's go. It's actually cool here today, which is nice because the last two days here was pretty warm. But today, finally, it's cooled off a little bit. But next week is supposed to be hell. I'm not looking forward to it. Like pushing. I don't think it'll be pushing 100 degrees here, but it'll be getting close, and I ain't looking forward to it, because I'm enjoying this nice, cool weather we're having today. I don't want no hot weather. I don't want nothing melting on me. I don't, whatever the case is, I don't want it. Summer can go away. <laughs> Je oh, just got home. We took our time because everyone wanted to talk today around the table, which I felt so uncomfortable. <laughs> That's me. That's me. But I'm glad you're home. Glad you got home safe. I hope you had uh, the most best of time you could have, even if you were uncomfortable. But I believe, I be believe me. I know what that's like when you get go into like a family thing, and then everyone just wants to talk around the table. It's like I'm gonna go watch TV. See you later. <laughs> well, that would be if we're at someone's house. But if we're at a restaurant, I'd be like, can I go? Sorry, I don't know what to do. <laughs> it's not normal this heat here. No, I, I don't, I don't, I apologize, I don't know exactly where you are, but I know the general area, and I don't know weather over there. But I, actually where I'm at, it's not normal to have heat. We can get pretty hot, but sometimes it can get warmer than it should be, and it's not fun. Because I am a little bit in California, higher up in the mountains, so we will get a little bit cooler weather than lower elevations, but at the same time, we can get warm. Take me if you are cool. 75 at the minute, but 98% humidity. Oh, wait, let me look. 
Let me look what ours is. Yesterday our humidity was five. Let me see what it's currently. Currently, according to my phone, it's 66, 12% humidity. It's a little better than yesterday. Yesterday was like 80 almost, I think, with like 5%. Oh, they wanted to talk about all the medicals, so I was, please let me leave. Yeah, I, I get ya. I get ya. You're just like, no, I'm good, thanks. Let's, I'm... Um, can I go? I mean, you guys talk about it, maybe, but I'm gonna go. Oh, strawberry hibiscus tea? That sounds really good. I don't know if I've ever had a strawberry tea, if I'm being completely honest. I'm trying to think. I've had a lot of different kinds, but I don't think I've ever had strawberry hibiscus. Or strawberry in general. I love strawberry things. There's currently a snowstorm in Colorado. Yeah, usually, uh, when, not always. When, for me, I could tell when Colorado's get some interesting weather, because sometimes here in California, what happens is when they have a weather storm coming in Colorado, it gets freaking windy here. That's how it is. It, it gets freaking windy here. I don't know, like, I don't know weather. I don't know how all that crap works. But that's usually what's happening. Colorado's got something coming down. Something shifts in the atmosphere, and all the wind comes over here to California. I hate it. I hate it. I hate the wind so much. Listen, Chad, I got to pack my bags. I'm going to 12% humidity right now. <laughs> you, yeah, yeah, come on over. It's fine. It's, a, it's only 12 today, so it's a little better. Yesterday was that, remember you guys, I was telling you guys how there was, when California gets wind and really low humidity, it's like dead air blowing at you. That was yesterday. Yeah. We went shopping and it was like 80 degrees, 5% humidity, blowing in your face and it felt like stale dead air. And then I went outside and worked because we had no power and it was the same thing. I was working outside, dead air blowing at me all day. But today's a little better, 12%. <laughs> I know you all, a lot of you live where it's like very humid. I live in California, that's not a thing. We don't have humidity, we have anti-humidity. That's what we live with. Um, all right, is that all I needed to tell you guys is we're gonna get to Porsche today. I don't have to be off early, but I have to cook some stuff tonight. For dinner and I have to cook a little bit extra so I need to get off as fast as I can around six but, 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 but I'm just making sure I think that's all I needed to talk to you guys about today discord is open once again I'm going to preach it to the fullest because I want you guys to know it's open if you have not joined it and I hope you guys enjoy your time over there just remember same rules as chat to make long story short don't be a dick because the mods will attack you if they do I will attack you if you do so just remember that in the Discord, and um, yeah, I think that's all. We get the days sometimes when you open the door and your ass cheeks glue, yeah, glued together with sweat. I've heard that before. Like, I mean, I've had family who live over there, like they live in Missouri, and I have a, a really close friend who lives in Missouri as well. And yeah, I used to tease them all the time, like, nah, 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 like 10% here at the moment. <laughs> We have 90 degree this, oh, this weekend? Yeah. We ha we're having 90 degree next week, so we're gonna take it from you right next Wednesday. You got, you're a little more humid than us, Magic. Holy crap, you got 18%, we got 12 according to my phone. And is it really, really, really windy where you're at, Magic? Cause it's like freaking blowing outside today. It's supposed to calm down now, but it, it was like 40 gusts wind outside. I know that's not a lot, but it is quite a bit for us. Did I get all the emotes you wanted or did you need more? No, no, I got them all. You gave me all the ones I needed. Thank you, Brad. I got them all and I appreciate you sending them to me. I was going to do that yesterday. What, why I wanted them. I'm not going to tell you why I wanted them. <laughs> but I was going to do that yesterday and then I didn't have power till like 5 o'clock at night. So I was just like, screw it. I'll do it Saturday or Sunday. Oh, there's a breeze. No, nah, no, nah, we got like 40. Well, it's calming down now, but last night I couldn't sleep because I have a little bit of anxiety when it gets windy. And it was blowing last night and I was just like, oh, hail to the no. Stuck on my Spotify and tried to go back to sleep. But yeah, yesterday was pretty windy. Today has been pretty windy, but it's supposed to start calming down because the wind advisory actually expired. 
but I think they said for us it was supposed to be windier. Like, more up north. Where's my game? I know it's on the screen for you guys, but where's my game for me? Oh, here it is. Alright, let me turn up the sound for us, because I always turn it down because chickens in this game don't shut up for five seconds. Um, I think I can push continue. Alright, oh, game for you guys. Sound of me. There we go. Alright, so let's see what's going on in Portia. I have no idea. It has been almost a month again, and I apologize that it's been a month since we get back to Portia. But, uh, we had to play Village to finish it, and then we had, uh, I wanted to show you guys Animal Crossing, and then I had a day off, because that's just how it goes. Hey, Gus is here! That's right, he gave us money. <laughs> I think I got off last time right before, or right when that happened, and I was like, oh, I hope that happens again. I want more money. Look! We live with Gus and QQ! Love it, love it. Hey, Magic, by the way, I know you probably haven't... Uh, well, I don't know how long have you been playing Portia. But, um, who are you deciding to romance in Portia? I tried... Wait, wait, I tried to get them fast, but... Tater Brain, the last few days... Oh, no, it's fine. Like I said, I wasn't on yesterday anyway, so it's all good. It's, um... I had no hurry in getting them. I just wanted them... I asked you for them because I was thinking about it. I was like, oh my god, I've been trying to ask this for, like, the last week. Plus. And my brain, like, I couldn't remember when I was actually on. And I was laying in bed thinking about something. I was like, oh, I gotta ask real quick while it's on my brain. No! no! <laughs> I know you said kidding, but no! Magic is in love with Nora. <laughs> no! Nora is our enemy. <laughs> Nora's fine for me now because now we're not with Arlo, so it's I don't even half the time see Nora, if I'm being completely honest. Like I don't see her very often. But still, it's funny, I just like to I just like to not like her. But we if you guys did not see last stream I'm sorry. Last stream, we ended up marrying Gus and literally I was almost in tears. And like by tears, I mean I was so touched <laughs> by what was going on in the game because one, it was kind of like a side mission how it happened and I don't normally go to side missions because I just sometimes I'll miss them and never see them. And it was like this setup to go see Gus on the beach and then he proposed and I was just like floored because I wasn't expecting it in the game and I really thought that I had to do it. I thought, like, my character had to do it. I didn't think that was going to be an animation in the game. You know, I'm used to playing The Sims. The Sims, they don't ask you to marry you. Your Sim has to do it. Which is fine most of the time. But I was like, I want the game to, like, just randomly ask my other Sim to marry me. Marry my Sim, I mean. So, that happened literally right at the end of stream. And then, um, this is the first time we've seen Gus in our house living with us. Because we were... Ending right when all that happened. And I don't know how far we are in the game. Like, I really don't know how much longer we got. But we're going to work on it today and see if we can uh, get a little farther and see how close we are. Just don't give Arlo your wood like Scarlet. No, don't do that. Don't give anyone your wood like Scarlet. <laughs> I don't even know who I can marry. I honestly can't remember because it's been a while since I've actually looked it up to see who is romanceable and not. All I know just off the top of my head, obviously, are Arlo and Gus because those are the two I romanced. Actually, kid. Oh! I know how to look. There's actually a way to look in game. Sorry. How do I do this? Social. So anyone with a heart you can marry, obviously. So you got Gus, Sam... Albert, Oaks, Ginger, Remington, em oh, there's a lot. Remington, Emily, May, Sonia, Antoine, Django. You can almost marry every character who's not already married, I guess. Because Carol's married. A couple of those colorful brothers who are all different colors. Phyllis? I kind of wanted to go for Phyllis. Dr. Zhu? I liked Dr. Zhu. He was going to be my next choice. Almost any character, except for there's just very few you can't. Obviously the children. <laughs> Thank goodness. And then the older characters you can't. So almost anybody. 
It is doing it now in Sims with the new story. Is it doing it now with the new story progression? I haven't really played around much with the Sims with the story progression and stuff. I kind of just do old school Sims and just go play, you know, norm. I don't want to say normal. There's just like old school Sims. I have not played with the new story progression at all. I think you should marry Arlo just so Scarlet can come to the wedding. <laughs> yes, I actually kind of agree like to that. I actually do like Arlo. Arlo is actually a really cool character. I really liked him. And it, you know, just my advice to anybody, to anybody in game, please read. Please read what each thing does because you're going to do what I do and give Arlo wood. And it's going to actually be to break up with him and not actually a present. <laughs> That's how stupid I am. But in the end, like I said, it was funny. I can't really be mad at it. It was funny. I think it's still, it was great. <laughs> Mary Brad. Well, Brad. well, Brad says he's Papa Bear. Sadly, we can't marry Papa Bear. Exactly. Only if you get Papa Bear, that would be my choice. I know. I really wish they would have made him. Romanceable. Sorry about. Oh, no worries, Magic. No worries. I don't. I don't think I, I think I was talking to you, but I don't think I was really talking to you. I was just saying how Arlo. I I I, I agree. You should marry Arlo because I do like Arlo a lot. Oh, I haven't played since so long. That's why I was asking. I haven't played with story progression, so I don't know. <laughs> like I said, I play like the old, not old school, but like the Sims without story progression and all that stuff because I never really found it interesting but I should open a new save file and see, try it out to see because I have no idea actually I didn't like the story progression update but if maybe if, if your sims can ask to marry your sim I might but I don't know I don't actually know I play sims like once every month once a month oh I already talked to you I was just sitting here contemplating his life right now. He's like, what did I marry into? This girl has nothing in her house. <laughs> oh no, Gus! Oh wait, can he not get in the bed? No, Gus, you can sleep in this bed. Angel. Let's give Gus a good old kiss before we leave today. Alright, have a wonderful day, darling! Does he say anything new? Angel, you're back. I didn't leave, but okay. Have a great day, Gus! I feel so bad for him. He right now he's just like, I need to maybe make a bed for QQ. I gotta upgrade my house. I did not expect Gus to be moving in so fast. It sucks. Oh, I heard some of it. Okay. Like I said, I don't think I was really saying anything too, <laughs> too interesting. <laughs> that is more than I play. I think I have played it once in 2022. I think I've played it maybe two or three times in 2022, if I'm being completely honest. I, I played, what was it, last weekend? I played. And I was going to actually play yesterday. Because I was like, okay, I'm taking my mental day. I'm going to just kind of chill, hang out in a game. And I opened up the game. And then at the same time, I was just like, I don't feel like playing. Oh, sorry. I never mean to stand on my lambs. My problem with The Sims is they do so many updates that uh, I have like a million, I feel like a million mods in my game. And then the game freaking updates and I have to go through every single one of them and update it and I just get to the point where it's just like, I don't want to be doing this right now. And then I get tired and I'm just like, screw it, I don't want to play anymore. I had too much to update, I don't want to play. Maybe I'll marry Nora and Arlo, happy family, hey. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> I wish. Well, that would make the game not so. Never mind. I was like, I wish you could have like two loves in the game. But at the same time, I don't. I don't think that would make the game as user friendly. 
You know what I mean? Not that user friendly. There's like a word I'm looking for, but not so innocent. We'll put it that way. Because once you're like in a relationship with Arlo or whoever, Arlo Gust, they won't let you be in another relationship. <laughs> Okay, uh, I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, days half gone, and I literally just walked around, did nothing. Uh, so we have two things we're doing. We're doing Dana's Mining Company and the Western Plateau, which I don't know which one would progress the story. Molly wants you to construct a lift and install it at the design location for easy access to the Western Plateau. Dana... One, or no, excuse me. Dana is collecting opinions from everyone in town about starting an ore delivery company. She is grateful. I think I need to go do that, by the way. Uh, she's grateful for your support. Please wait for her news. Help Dana to collect, or Dana, Dana, to collect and install the conveyor belt near the her mine. Neither are on a time frame. So let's do hers. Let's do Dana's. Oh, I'm already doing something. Wait a minute. What are we doing? Oh, we're doing the lift. Okay, apparently we're doing the lift. Marry them all? You know what? I would kind of wish there was like a mod you could do that just to see if you could actually get them all. Family friendly. That was kind of the word I was looking for. Thank you. This game wouldn't be family friendly. But you know what? I wouldn't care. <laughs> I'd still play it. You need to have a mod to put in so that you could do that. The sub to number one hoe, yeah. <laughs> we haven't had a sub since, so that one still <laughs> rolls around. That one still rolls around. Um, what do I gotta do? 20 iron wood planks, 20 carbon steel bars, one hoister. I think I was probably working on the hoister. Three bearings, two steel plates. Okay, let me see what we got going here, because I've got a lot going. And I don't really, um, like, I, like, I, like I said, I play this game kind of just as I go. Um, I don't make anything ahead of time when the game asks for carbon steel plates. I make them when I want. I don't pre-make everything because I just like to do it at that pace. I forgot what I needed already. Steel plate. I mean, I could blow through this game and absolutely craft everything ahead of time but at the same time I just kind of want to go slow I just want to do what what is this horn ball oh okay magic <laughs> unlock the magic just gifted five subs thank you so here let's pause this thank you so much for the five gifted subs let me see who they were too To DVD, uh, best DVD jump scare, the Rogue Fay. Oh, I know I screwed the name up last time. I don't know how I still say it. Not mo moe, ni moe. Oh, anyway. What and only nuts. Let's go. <laughs> and pathless wolf. I remember one and only nuts coming in. <laughs> thank you so much for the gifted sub. If you gotta get to sub. From Magic, please remember to say a thank you if you are here. The Rogue Faith, thank you so much for saying thank you to Magic. How are you doing? And I appreciate you, Magic, for the five gifted subs to the community. And thank you, Blossom, so much for giving I Magic a it, shout I out. Oh, let's it, go. I did it. <laughs> <laughs> I love that clip. <laughs> I don't even know how that happened. I just That's a longer started. version than the one in uh, your channel trailer. Good job. I haven't even managed that one yet. <laughs> Thank you both, Blossom. Oh my gosh, magic. <laughs> Sorry. That one pops up so often, I love it. Thank you both, Blossom and Brad, for giving totally magic a shout out. Gold. Magic gets two because she's amazing. I absolutely agree. <laughs> <laughs> you get two sides of magic here. You got her clip of her playing oh parts in with friends. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Goof it off, and then you got drunk magic. <laughs> Thank 
thank you to both of you for shout out uh, for shout outs for magic and as everyone who got a sub welcome to being a celebrity of skelly town i hope you enjoy your emotes and everything who did you romance i romanced gust and he is currently our husband that is who we got to romance we <clears throat> we were um we were romancing arlo that's a long story if uh if a mod wants to put command arlo in chat that'll show you what happened <laughs> but yes we currently like last stream how do you do this that last stream we uh got to marry gus oh my gosh what are you guys doing magic <laughs> magic what are you doing Unlock the magic just gifted five subs. Magic, thank you for the five more gifted subs. You are you are way too amazing. Thank you so much for the five gifted subs for Patch and Ram and Princess Nafia and Psyched Out Forever. I like that name. And Trina Rar. Thank you so much for those gifted subs. If you are in chat, please remember to say thank you to Magic for being so amazing in her generosity and hopefully if you are here enjoy your emotes and welcome to being a little celebrity of skelly town oh, ship rad <laughs> you scared me with your wiener oh my gosh i love that clip <laughs> oh. thank you brad for putting arlo in chat for me <laughs> And thank you again for another shout out for magic and also being that clip that popped up. I loved it. <laughs> I love it. I like when we get a good variety of clips. I'm gonna switch my music real quick, sorry. I'm thinking about it. I want more chill. Let's see if this station works. This is called chill. I've got two chill stations currently that I can use. Y'all made me lose track of what I was doing. <laughs> I, you guys know, I can't pay attention to two things at once and I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, carbon steel bars. That's what I'm currently working on. Is that what this is? Yes. And I currently have none in my inventory. Woohoo! Big summer blowout. Magic, thank you so much for the five. Hundred biddies! You are completely spoiling me today, Magic. Thank you so much for that. Actually, it took me a second to figure out what clip was playing, or not what clip, but what thing was playing, and then I realized what it was. I was like, "What the hell is that sound clip?" Magic, thank you so much for the five hundred biddies. You are, like I said, you are too amazing. You are way too amazing. You know I love you. My inventory is all screwed up. I have three. I have 20. Okay, so there's, sorry, there's 17 currently being made. There's three in my inventory, so that'll be done. Next, I need to make iron planks. It's painting! Oh! <laughs> well, I appreciate that magic so much. You are amazing. And if anyone in chat who is not following magic, Go, go, what are you doing with your life? Go follow Magic, go give her all the love and definitely join in on her streams. She is a lot of fun. She plays Dead by Daylight. She does play with viewers. I think, I'm sorry if you don't play with all viewers, but she does play with people. So if you do want to play and hang out in her chat for a bit, she will always accept people to come and play with her. By the way, Magic, how was Dead by Daylight yesterday? How was the fog? Woohoo. <laughs> Big summer blowout. I need iron wood. That sucks. Ah, thank you so much for the 500 biddies. What are you guys doing? You guys, you guys are being way too nice to me today. You guys are just, you're spoiling me and I don't know how to react. <laughs> I, it's literally 12 o'clock in my game and I have done nothing because I've been paying attention to you. <laughs> But I appreciate it, Brad. Thank you so much for the 500 biddies. But, ooh, let's go. Hit iron. 
I was gonna say hit ironwood because I'm looking for ironwood. Oh, my llama, by the way. Yo, my stupid llama, I can't catch him. Uh, hit eerie rank one, nice, let's go. Why the fog was fun, like I said, Sometimes the fog can be really rough, so you never know. I always like to ask if it's a day that I'm not on, how was it? Because we all know Dead by Daylight can have very bad days. I cannot find a happy medium in my earphones today. I'm either feel like I'm yelling over it or... What do I need? Game. Deploy successful. Please remember to check back tomorrow. I keep trying to check back tomorrow. Well, I do. And every day, there's nothing. I remembered where to get iron when I'm trying to just remember right now. That isn't the second llama. I'm trying to get the second llama. The game does not want me to have a Harry, I swear. Every day I go check, it's like, please check back tomorrow. And every day I go back and check and it's like, no, the llama ate the stuff and left. All right, let's go get some iron when I think it's out here in the desert, if I remember correctly. Uh, how do I get there? This bridge. I need a lot. I didn't know how much I needed, but I need a lot. I think it's these trees. I'm gonna go a little bit farther out, but I think it's I think it's these ones right here that need the uh Oh the have the not need the have the iron wood in them. Let's see. Let's see if I was right. Okay, this is ironwood. So let's cut a couple of these trees down. I did not really pay attention to how much I needed. Oh, we'll cut. We'll, we'll cut. We'll cut a bunch down and see if that's enough. Ah! Sweaty people already rank one. Get good, Brad. I agree. Get good. Then there's me over here sitting in the, the ash still. <laughs> yep. Good old ash rank V. That's why I wanted to play on uh, Wednesday after the PTV. I was going to play the PTV only for just a little bit. And then go and um, try and rank up a little bit. Finish. Or not finish. But continue with the rift because I'm a little behind that it oops, want to be. But... I don't know, that PTB was fun, but at the same time, I felt like it wasn't as fun as the previous ones, meaning with the people who I got. I felt like everyone was taking the PTB way too serious. And it just, it seemed not as friendly as it had been in previous ones, but at the same time, it was still fun. I can't complain. But after I got off, I was just like, I had a lot of fun playing the dredge, playing Hattie, playing with all the new stuff map especially gorgeous but then as I got off I was just like it just wasn't as friendly I met so many great people through the PTB the last two times and this time I don't I didn't meet one person uh that who would come into stream to say hi or gg or anything but it is what it is it was still fun and I can't wait for it to come out I can't wait for it to come out by the way you hit command tiktok and chat a new TikTok and Hover. So it's the same video, so if you're on one or the other, it don't matter. But a brand new TikTok and Hover video went up today that showed my first reaction to the Dredge in-game. When I got him in my match, I mean, not like... Not like my reaction from him on the main screen. I clipped a couple of things the other day after stream to showcase my reaction to him. The Mori... What's another thing I clipped? Oh, when he jump scared me in the locker. That one. Those are all, 
I'll be going up on TikTok soon. Uh, Lloyd! Return to your home. Okay, let's go see if this is done, and then I need to see if I got enough ironwood. Nope, I didn't get nearly enough. I need I need more mucus too. Oh, oh my gosh, so much for iron wooden blanks. I'm just freaking low. Whoa, last gold floor, that's not low. I'm sitting over here, Ash Ash one, I think. Didn't we hit Ash one on Monday? Cause I wasn't gonna get off until we did. Excuse me, you came into chat and said hi while you was in the PTB, what? Thank you, Magic, for posting both of my TikTok and Hover if you guys are not following me on there. I do have a TikTok and a Hover. They're pretty much the same site, except for Hover is more game-based. So if you don't have a Hover, no worries. The exact same video goes up on TikTok as well. <laughs> I got plenty of mucus. I'm, I'm thinking you mean off off the game. Lately, I lately I have two. Freaking wind blowing up all the crap as well. Danny got Airy 4 yesterday? Oh, holy crap, you guys are just blowing through this one. God, those take forever. Thirteen. Oh, okay. This is my biggest problem about this game. I forget to refuel. Um, so let me just do this real quick. Give me all this stuff in here. Refuel 19 hours. Good. So we're gonna have to go back. Gonna have to go back and get even more. Uh, ironwood. Because it takes... What is it? Four pieces for one board? Oh my lord. Oh, it's heck, but forever. Okay, let me put all my stuff in here real quick. And then we will... I don't know what time it is in game. Either go to sleep or... Wander around. Oh, we came into chat and said hi to you while you were playing the PTV. Yes, you guys all did. Yes, nobody knew is what I was trying to say. Because we met Chuck on the PTV. I know we met a couple other people on the PTV as well. I feel bad. I can't name everybody, but I have a bad memory. But I just remember we met Chuck on the PTV because we met on the first PTV I ever played, which was Sadako. And then, random chance, we actually met again in the mid-chapter PTB, which was funny. And I was sad we didn't actually cross paths again in the last one, but you know, he couldn't be on at the time I was on and I couldn't be on the time he was on and all that, so. But yeah, the last few, it's just like, I met a couple of really good people through the PTB and this one, barely anyone even talked in the in-game chats. It, I mean, a couple of people said GG, but I don't know. I just felt like it wasn't as friendly as it had been in the past. Probably just one of those days. Just one of them days, can't complain. We still had fun and that's all that matters. My inventory is a big mess, so I apologize if half the stream I'm sitting here. See, I even had a ring. I even had a ring for, for Gus because I thought I had to do it. So now I've got this extra one if uh, any of the characters ever say, hey, do you have a wedding ring? Which a character did ask us that once. Uh, where is all my fur? Oh no, my soda's giving me the hiccups. That's not cool. The <laughs> flat sweat. <laughs> Nope, I'm not right, I don't sweat. Yep, right? Same. I'm not right, I don't sweat either. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Actually, you know what? It's actually kind of a... Kind of a good idea to really, like, play the hell out of the game early in the... After reset. And then when you get toward the end, like, right before rank reset, you're not, like, totally trying to just grind and get there to as high as you can get. Because that's what I do. That is exactly what I do. I try right at the end to try and get as high as possible before that rank reset. And I never really make it. I always get to like gold lately. Cause we've, we've, we've subtract, 
subtracted a day out of our uh out of our dvd to do variety so i can't find diddly crap in my inventory i don't even really know what i'm looking for um I'll just hold on to everything else. Whatever. It's 19 o'clock. Woo! Oh, wait! Wait! You! 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 Whoever you are, come back here! I see you have a little thingy above your head. I would like to discuss with you what that is. Hello! I wish I had... Oh! He will... Oh, that's right! I looked that up! He says, I wish I had one peach amulet. And I think I can't get it yet because, uh, there's... It's like a later thing in the story, I think it said. So I can't even get that to him right now. I remember looking that up. He's the only one at the moment moment who desires anything, so. Alright, so that's that. Oh look! Oh my gosh, it's even on the calendar! Oh Gust and my wedding anniversary. Oh my god, so freaking adorable. So we got married in month one, day 27. And this is technically, I'm on year three. Oh my god, so cute! Okay, let's go talk to some people. Oh! Never mind, it's Friday. Sunday. Sunday. Hello, sister in law. Hey. I haven't been able to meet the flying pig member yet. What's she like? I heard she's really tough. If I'm being completely honest, Ginger, I forget who she is. <laughs> I have no idea, actually, who she is. Ah, uh, father-in-law. Not much happening this week. Everything... I think that is going well in our town. That's right, it is. I love Sanwa's new shampoo so much. I just went to get my roots done, and now I feel like I'm swimming in a sea of flowers. Freaking little man, one. He's so freaking amazing. Uh, oh! I hit Higgins. Well, you know what? He deserved it. Yes, that is chilled. I figured that's probably. What was that? Was that the music? I thought someone played a sound oh, clip. I figured that's probably how it would be, and that would be really nice to be able to just like get as high as possible early on, and then right at the end, you don't have to try too hard to get there. Okay, yeah, I'm just going home. Chocolo! How are you doing? Great park. Uh, boy. <laughs> you climbing up to the <laughs> to the rigging? To the crow's nest. Thank you, Brad, so much for giving Chuck worry, a shout out. Boy. And magic double shout out. Let's go. Great fart. I apologize Hold. for saying hi early. No worries. No worries at all. I hope you're doing Hold well. Hi. Spyglass. I don't know where the hell Looks we're like going, it. by the way. Also, I don't know Mermaid how to make this go faster. I need to redo my house. Oh, shit. Wait, did I fuck up? I didn't fuck up. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm okay. Oh, my gosh. I you thought can I fucked see up. the freaking diamond ring on my finger. Let's go. So I'm to see your face every day. Oh, oh, it isn't much, but I'll get there for the meal. Six. I don't get money today. <laughs> I'm in the middle of a fight right now, money. bro! <laughs> you're doing good! Good to hear, Chuck! Glad you're doing good! And you're very welcome for the shoutouts. See if these is fun. See if these looks fun. I currently don't have it, because I've just never, ever got it. No real reason. Just never have. Actually, I didn't get it at first because my computer couldn't handle it. But, my computer could definitely handle it now. But it's just, it's just one of those ones I've just never gotten around to, which I save with like a hundred million games. I want like so many games, I want to play so many, and it's just like, I don't get around to them as quick as I would like. That was your first $100 bit donation? Holy crap, good job. Skr uh, Skrillet! I was trying to say Scarlet and Curry at the same time. Scarlet. That's my new name. Uh, Curry just tricked me. Oh no, what'd he do? We, oh, he stretched up like he wanted to give me a kiss and he bit my nose. Well, rude. <laughs> what a rude little trick. Kind of cute, but rude. <laughs> 
You played a lot of Sea of Thieves on the Xbox Game Pass because the pay because you pay the price for oh thousands of games. Yeah, and I I Magic's told me I should get game uh game the game box. I swear I cannot talk today if I like even wanted to. Words are not friendly to me today. Uh, I remember Magical, like, probably last year sometime told me I should get Xbox Game Pass for that reason. And like I said, the only reason I never have is because I don't get to the games as fast as possible and I would be paying for playing nothing at the moment. I feel like one day when I feel like I can actually get to games faster, I will probably get it. But at the moment, it's just like I don't ever get to these games and I would be paying for playing absolutely nothing at the moment. It surprised the hell out of me while I was playing. <laughs> wow. Oh, playing. Wow. That's how I was going to say that. World of Warcraft. <laughs> that would absolutely floor me as well. I, I don't, I don't, uh, I don't think I've ever got anything that big. And I don't, don't, don't do it. Don't, I don't suggest it. Don't do it. Uh, but I remember when I got my first really big raid. Like, it was like 50-some people, and I, I don't think it was clipped, and it's long gone. I was floored, though. Having, like, 50 people in your chat when you're a really itty-bitty streamer and you have no idea literally what you're doing, and that happens, it's like, I don't know what to do! What do I say? Who are you people? That's how I kind of felt. <laughs> it was just a little loved it, but, but still, I agree, but still, that was rude. But kind of cute, I mean, it was just a little nip, so... At least you didn't like take your whole nose off, you know what I mean? <laughs> My cat likes to run at me. Like what she'll do is she'll get really excited and I'll be laying in bed and she'll be running around my bedroom all excited. And what she'll do is she'll run and jump on me while I'm sleeping. And sometimes I feel like she's gonna take my eye out because she's obviously running at full speed, jumping. So she's got her claws out to land and she lands on my face. Rude! But at the same time, you know, she's having fun. But I've had some good, nice little marks on my face from my cat totally attacking me and not on purpose. It's always shocking. Yeah, it is. I remember... Did I ever talk to him? Uh, I remember my first one and it was just like, I didn't know what to do. Because I was just like an DVD streamer. I didn't know. I was got, I got all nervous and everything. But even still, you get those ones with millions of people, it feels like. And it's like, I don't know what to say. I'm going to make a complete ass of myself. But at the same time, I'm trying to keep my cool because it's like, yeah, you know, you get that feeling. <laughs> Okay. Poor Gus! He always is sitting down Thank napping. <gasps> I would really like one umbrella. Could you help me? Of course. Love of my life. I could definitely do that. Alright. Hugs before I go start my day. I hope you have a lovely day at work, Gus. I will make you an umbrella for whatever reason. I don't know, but I will make you one. Oh, Elfie tripped me yesterday. My back is still hurting from it, but not as bad as yesterday. I was able to cook today, which I couldn't do yesterday. That sucks. My 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 cat did that to, to me not too long ago. I don't think I really... I don't think I really hurt myself. Like, she gets under my feet, though, a lot. And, you know, I can't blame her. But at the same time, it's like... I tripped and fell and now I'm hurt. But yeah, my cat, she she will sometimes run at my face. <laughs> and so I'm glad some days I don't have a face cam because I'll have this giant like cut on my face from her flying across the room onto my bed while I'm sleeping. But I hope you're I hope you're feeling better, Eska. I know you said your back's still hurting, but not as bad. I hope you get all better. Cats like to do that. Cats love to trip you. I know, not necessarily mine as much, but um, my parents' cats love, love to get under your feet. Okay, those are good. Let's go see what's in the mail. Hello? Oh, workshop! Oh, it's the end of the month. That's right. Congratulations on- I'm still number two. On obtaining the number two position in the workshop, ranking last month. You are so close to getting number one. Continue your hard work and you'll get it soon. 
You probably get number two at a certain point of the game, and I don't really pay attention. I'm just doing my thing. Let's go see if our llama's there. Oh, yes! Yes! Look, we got a llama! Okay, I forget what we have to do. Oh, W. Dang it. A. D. W. Oh, no! Oh, no! I'm gonna screw this up. I totally forgot this is what the minigame was. Next, we're gonna get, try and get a different llama, but this we'll have to do for now. There's also, you can get, um, I think it was a cotton llama. Oh, I almost missed that because my finger just slipped. Did I get it? Did I get it? We got a new llama! Woohoo! All right, let's go put, this is Harry. Welcome to the family. How do I name him? Okay, return. I don't remember how to name him. I'll figure that out. I will have to figure that out. I missed a little bit of chat, just a second. Ducky is excited because we won our first match and someone a D seed. Nice. Even notice Duck is bronze four. Let's go. The worst was tripping over pepperoni the other day. I oh the not the other day. The day I had foot surgery was supposed to be non-weight bearing on my foot, so was using crutches to go across the hall to the bathroom. She got under my foot, landed on the foot I should not have, and fell into the standing. Oh, standing, holding the TV, knocking it off, and oh, setting on the stand. Ow. Oh, that don't sound good at all. That sucks. But that's what cats do. They just know. They just know when to get under your feet at either the most opportune time or... Yeah, it's really just most of the opportune time, which is most times, but still. That had to hurt. Especially after a foot surgery, but everything else, that had to hurt. This one already has a name. It's a colorful llama, but I think I can rename it. Because it just says colorful llama. Follow, interact. Maybe I can't rename it, but I swear I could. Maybe I have to wait? Because I remember us naming him. I remember... I remember that. But I don't see, like, a... At the moment, somehow to do it. I might have to look it up. Oh, rename! Here it is. Harry. Lloyd and Harry. I don't know why Lloyd is always so mad. He just he constantly a mad llama. Uh, because he's hundred wait, hunger level 100 percent Does that mean he's hungry or he's good? Like if it's a hundred percent, does that mean he's full or hundred percent hungry? I would think it would be hundred percent full. All right, we'll train Lloyd. Or, excuse me. He's got food. We'll keep this filled up for him now because we've got two llamas. So what I want to do, let me go pet all my animals for the day. Because we're kind of currently waiting on all our stuff anyway. I will never sell these, by the way. Just saying. Never ever will I say sell these because these are my animals and it took me so long to get them. Oop. Oh, I 
pet you twice. I freaking love that <laughs> they have like these little poos right there. I don't know why that is entertaining to me. Got one of those knee scooters the other day, so she couldn't trip me again. That would be a definitely a good idea, but also fun. <laughs> I don't know why those knee scooters have always looked so, like so much fun. Not, not for the reason why you have it, but I would literally probably buy one just to have fun on it. They need a, they desperately need a, uh, a search bar in this thing. I don't know where umbrella would be. Oh, here it is. Two copper bars, fiber cloth, and I need more spines. I forget where spines come from. Trying to think all the animals we have that we could go attack. I wish I told you. It says from loot. I don't know what loot it is, though. Still have issues. Oh, still have issues with that foot. I do not recommend Achilles. Ooh, Achilles tendon surgery. Oh, yeah, I've heard. I have heard for sure. I had a coworker who had Achilles tendon surgery, and he used to tell me it's not good. <laughs> the surgery was like four months and was painful and horrible. Yeah. I he had a coworker, like I said, I had a coworker who had it. Uh, it was a long time ago now, so I can't remember all, you know, everything he went through. But I remember even up till the final day we worked together, he still kind of struggled with that foot from that surgery. I can't really remember why he had it, like, you know, what trigger him to have to have that surgery but I do remember it was hell for him for a long time okay um let's see still waiting on these so this is gonna be just a little bit longer until we finally can get all the carbon bars for this. Oh, the hoister. I have that. Where is it? This is done. So let's go put this up here. Come on. Done. Um, uh, let's see. Got a couple things I want to do. I'm just trying to decide what to do first. Let's take Harry. Oh, by the way, this is what I was going to go show you guys. Wait, no. Oh. You will gain nothing. No, no. Fine, we'll take Lloyd. I forgot. You can't take him while they're training. So next we'll try and get the Cotton Llama. But I have to make an advanced trap. And I think what I needed for an advanced trap was a lot of the things I'm making currently for the lift. So we will just make that at another time. But that is definitely the next thing I want to get. Um... Because I think I wish I would have known that earlier and I would have gotten Harry as a cotton llama, but it's okay. We have Harry and Lloyd, and they are both colorful llamas. Um, let me go see if this is what I think gives us spines. Oh, Papa Bear's over here too, so let's go say hi. I want to say it is these guys who give spines. We'll see. <laughs> Yes. Okay. We'll beat up a couple of these. Ah, the water! Okay. That should be enough. I don't think I need that. Oh, where, <laughs> where was the interaction for that? Usually he has his cute little Saudi makes at us. Surgery was seven years ago. I now have custom insoles I have to use in my shoes. I have exercises I have to do every day on the foot four times a day. I have a splint I have to use at night when I sleep. Oh, and no more than six inch heels. Holy crap. That is a lot of stuff. I can't, I can't really remember. I just know that my coworker, he used to just, I think he had like custom shoes or maybe something in his shoe or whatever. Because he was on his feet like all day long most of the time. He did have his, he had a desk because he was in a charge of a certain section of our business, but he did have to sit down sometimes because it was too much and everything. But he was on his feet a lot of the day. But at the same time, he didn't share everything with me. So there might have been other things he was struggling with that he just didn't share with me. Okay. 
But yeah, I, I just remember, like, even up to the day that we, our last day of work together, he still struggled. What is this? You're welcome, Papa Bear! You're so welcome. Is this my llama? There's so many llamas and crap around here. I don't know what's, which one's mine. Add to teacher. I've spent a lot of time on my feet too. True, true, true. Teachers do as well. That's what always sucks is if you have to have a surgery like that and then I've cut down all the trees and I hear some. And then you have a job that requires, oops, I'm out of stamina. A lot of time on your feet. Not good. My, um, uh, well, it was my coworker. So I also, the job I spent, had, the job I spent, the job I had spent a lot of time on my feet as well. And not only a lot of time on my feet, but a lot of time on my feet on con concrete floors. Because that was just the, the place we worked. It was just all concrete. There will be some days at my job I would spend literally probably 10 hours on my feet. Not straight. There would be a couple times where I could sit down, like, for lunch. But at the same time, there are days where I literally spent, like, 10, come on, 10 hours on my feet. That's why it was hard for me to come home from work and, like, want to play games. Because I was like, I just want to sit down and just relax. I don't want to do nothing. I just don't want to do crap. But then I'd have to come home and do something because I had to do something. I had to do, like, the dishes or whatever the case was. Yeah, back when I worked, I was on my feet like that all day until I went to sleep. Pretty much the same. Yeah. There would be days where I, would, I wouldn't have to be. Like, I was a bookkeeper as well. So there would be days where I would have to spend most of my time in my office sitting down and doing all the book work. But that wasn't an everyday occurrence. That was only... Depending on the time of month. What kind of paperwork I had to do and stuff like that. So there were some days at work where I would be sitting down. All day. Or most of the day. But at the same time I had ever, uh, other days where I was on my feet for like 10 hours. With breaks here and there, obviously. Law. California law. You have to take a break every so often. But... If you put all the hours together, it was that long. It's a big tree. <laughs> big tree. Uh, I am going to go home after that one. I really, being that it's four pieces of wood each. I still probably do not have the right amount, but it's getting late in the day, so we need to go home. I do this every time. I get lost. No, here's the bridge. I don't know why the desert here is so... I get turned around so easily. Because we unloaded trucks by hand most of the time, so picking up 200 pound rolls out of the back of a semi-truck... Ooh. No, thank you. We, we had a... We did deliveries once a week, but we didn't have to do it by hand. <laughs> we didn't have to unload it by hand. <laughs> Thankfully, but I didn't actually get to do all that stuff anyways, because um, I had other employees who did that. That was their job. Uh, no return. Uh, let me, let me give him a little pet. But I did work in receiving, though. I did do the receiving stuff, where I would pick up not 200 pounds of stuff, but I would pick up Whatever four gallons of paint would weigh. I have no idea what that would weigh. Oops! <gasps> Gusty Tom! All right, um, ironwood. Oh no! Oh no! I can only make four because I'm at. What did I do? I can only make four because I'm out of mucus. <sighs> Who's mucus? I'm trying to think. 
Wasn't those ones we just went and beat up? I wonder... I'm trying to get it without looking it up. Uh, maybe tomorrow in game we'll go around beating up. I still need more ironwood. It's still not quite enough, but... I need to go around and beat up some animals and see... <laughs> I hate doing that, but... Beat up some animals and see what it what it is. I said one hour, not one day. Um, uh, let's see. That's not done. That's not done. Let's go give Gus this uh, umbrella. Hi, Pinky. Hi, oh, darling. It looks great! Oh, you're so welcome. He even gave me money for that, and we're married. No, not the tea table. I'm trying to talk to Pinky. I have kind of ignored Pinky the last two days ever since Gust moved in. There you go. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to ignore you. You are still my number one. Don't worry. Oh, we picked up rolls that they made truck drivers and bus seats out of. Ooh, that does sound like it would be super heavy, yeah. We had, like, the stuff we had to order, some of it was, yeah, very heavy. And like I said, I don't know what four gallons of paint weighs, but I picked that up. Boxes of that, I mean. I just don't know off the top of my head how much it weighs. Because all the guys I used to work with, they're like, why don't pick that up let me pick it up i'm like hell no i can do it get away from me i can do it and then now my back is being like you should have let them pick that up <laughs> my back nowadays is telling me you should have just let them i should you know what i don't think i need money i have sixty-one thousand dollars I haven't opened this yet. Oh, I got another chair. Thanks. Um, but I don't really... Ah, it's too late. I don't really need money, so... Tomorrow's Papa Bear's birthday! Let's go! I already know what I can gift him. I can just gift him honey and he'll be happy. But we're gonna go to bed and then tomorrow we will, um... We'll go beat up some animals that I don't really want to do, but we will go beat up some animals. Gus, you can come to bed. You don't, I don't know why the Z's pop out of him. Gus, your hair! Okay, let's give him a kiss before we go to bed. Good night, darling. Oh, Pinky! Don't be watching, my goodness. I need to get like a bed for QQ. I don't know if that, he would actually use it. But it would just make me feel better if I had one for him. But I don't know if the actual animation would be him using it. I had like rocket ships and stuff on the gl on that glowed in the dark. I used to hear rolls and rolls of that stuff given to me when I was when it was discontinued, but I don't have any of it left, sadly. That is very interesting. That's sad you don't have any left, too. I, didn't, I don't think I ever would have guessed that. You're welcome, QQ. Okay, where's Pinky? That's why I never see Pinky in the morning. She goes to bed. Oops, I always do that. Pinky goes to bed Angel. when we Angel, wake up. Even though we're married, I'll still need to take care of my sister occasionally. Of course! Ginger! No offense, Gus. Ginger comes first. We love Ginger. And if it wasn't for her being only out at night and moving at the pace of a snail, I would have married her. But oh, am I disturbing your book reading? Sorry. I'll leave. Uh, but I freaking love Ginger, but she's very painful <laughs> to hang around. Because <laughs> she moves so slow. 
So I gave up. I was just like, I'll go for I'll go for Gust, and then she could be my sister-in-law. It's all good. Alright, five more of those finally. Well, I need eight more. Oh, that's too much math. I ain't doing that. Okay, um. Let me go say hi to all of my animals for the morning. That's not what I wanted. I forgot. Good boy, Harry. And then we're gonna take Harry out for the day. Well, that's not what I wanted. Go away. I have to pick up this poop. That is a freaking adorable emote blossom. I love that. I love you too, Blossom. Well, you know that funky busties look like look like or weird casino cover. They have all that funky pattern stuff. That is what we have. Yeah, I know exactly those weird. It's a good word for them. Funky patterns. Be right back. All right, no worries, Magic. No worries. Ooh, we got some honey. Um. Right before I started reading chat, I was gonna do something. I've lost my train of thought, <laughs> which isn't surprising. Papa Bear's birthday. Papa Bear's birthday. We were gonna feed all our animals. That's not what I wanted. I need to get some stuff for them. I'm running out of stuff. Look at my cows! Lloyd, back up. No, I'm trying to pet. I'm trying to get Lloyd. Lloyd just wants love. Lloyd's like, me! I, I pet this cow three times. <laughs> there we go! Lloyd's like, love me! Alright, there you go. No, I don't want to ride. I'm trying to get him to go back to his house so I can do this. Oh, I originally went into my uh, calendar to see if there was an event coming up. And in ruins, so there's no event coming up until the martial arts tournament, which is actually very fun. That's actually a very fun tournament to hang out with or play with, I mean. Look at all my chicks and ducks. You guys are so adorable. Oh my gosh, I need that one. I need that emote that Denny posted. <laughs> that one's freaking adorable too. I love, I love when you guys show off emotes. I was reading somebody else the other day say, uh, I don't think I followed him. I think it was one of those random ones that popped up in my Twitter feed. Uh, say that they got banned in someone's chat for posting their emotes. And that always rubs me the wrong way. I should be planting stuff, but I have no idea what I'm supposed to be planting, so we will get to that another day. But I love seeing not only your emotes, but anybody's emotes. I don't know why people get all torn up about people showcasing emotes. I think that's insecurity if you, if you ask me. He said what? Who said what? I'm trying to get fibers. I don't know if they come from just little trees or if they come from big ones too. Or vice versa. There we go. I I feed my llamas plant fibers, apparently. Okay. That should probably be plenty for now. Let's go grab a uh, Harry since we usually take Lloyd out and we will go see what animals we can beat up. Oops, fridge. 
Uh, fudge. There we go. See, I like those. I love seeing those. They're so cute. I love seeing your guys' emotes. See what animals are over here. <laughs> there you go, Brad. Do that. Do it. Do it. Showcase all the emotes. I don't know who said it. Can I get mucus from the rabbits? I, like I said, I think it was one of those, um... Ow! 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 Why can't I move? Okay, they don't give mucus. Okay, good to know. Let's go back this way. I think there might be maybe the crabs, but we'll see. Yeah, uh, anyways, I didn't finish my spot. Sorry, I was beating up animals. Uh, <laughs> it's just with some uh, random account that... Oh, mucus comes from them. Okay. That you know how, like, on Twitter, how when you... It shows you, like, topics or something... Not necessarily someone you follow, but just shows you like topics that are currently like hot on Twitter or something like that. And somebody's account popped up and says, yeah, I was banned in this account because I showed my emotes when I walked in or something and I had followed them forever. And I was like, I didn't say anything because I didn't know who they were, but I was like, that is still stupid. I know that was a conversation on Twitch a while back. That showcasing your own emotes with self-promotion and I still don't get it. I still don't get it why people get all upset about it. But just know, in my chat, go ahead. Showcase near those emotes, and also I will not ban you for that. Or time you out, or anything. Do these guys have mucus? Ah! Oh, I hit the colorful lava! No, it's just the snails. Okay, I don't- where's Harry? Here he is. There's too many, too many llamas. Let me go find some more, what, snails? Here's a snail. here we could also go cut some down cut down some more trees I don't know if I have enough mucus but can you go in these places oh my gosh you can <laughs> here and I have not noticed <laughs> okay we're gonna go visit these little houses right here I don't even know what they are there's apparently been something in the game that progressed and I just don't remember because it took us a while to get back to this game here and there oh hi teaser uh guys was like I crawled off and hid against, hit against the wall and he didn't get me killed because he lost oh because he lost me so no 4k for you nice i don't i don't like people who slug i mean sometimes i i do it but at the same time it's because everyone else is playing toxic and i think they deserve it but i still don't like it so no 4k for you who's some of zach that one's adorable too i like that one are all these that one's not this one's just like a barn. Oh, is this probably something? This is probably something we did, and I just don't remember. Let's go to this hotel. I want to see what's in here. What's 
this. <gasps> South Brock Trading Post. Oh, I kind of remember this now. Okay, yeah, this was a long time ago. <gasps> Hen! Wait, I can't add. What is, how do you work this? If I put this, if I put a plus, does that mean someone will give me one? Wait, let me see this. Uh, welcome to the South Block Trading Post, ran by Porsche's com uh, com Commerce Guild. A trade transport will travel from tra South Block to Sand Rock every week. See, that's where Sand Rock kind of comes in. Uh, all builders are encouraged to fill orders from Sand Rock and beyond. We will leave a wagon at your workshop and pick it up when the orders are filled. Okay. One, items posted on our trade posts are all dependent dependent on the demand from Sandrock and elsewhere. The trade post will update the demand of each item daily. Once you have accepted an order invoice, please try your hardest to fulfill it. If you do not complete an order on time, we will decrease the, decrease the maximum number of orders you can pick next time. We have a reputation to protect. If you try to change the order after you've already accepted it, we will only pay you the lowest unit price. Oh. This isn't, I don't have hens. So this is like if I put something in here. I got it. Okay, well, let's let's try this. Let's just put in like five milks and see what happens. Order from five milks, buyback price 20, total 20, delivery date. Okay. I'm just curious how that works. Oh my gosh, look at her. Hi. Granny, oh, Granny of the Hulu Brothers. This is, this, <laughs> this is Grandma, this is the other Grandma, this is her twin sister. I stay with Siwa and she's all alone, but it's good to see the brothers together again. And also the exact same voice, this is her twin. I don't have nothing for you. Holy crap, I forgot this place even existed. I didn't even know this place existed. What is this? Banquet table. I'm okay. Is this a banquet table? That is cute though. Can I buy this? I want to know how to make this. Oh, I have to do it after. Okay, what's this? Invitation letter. It excludes a pers it excludes a personal touch and it is used to invite friends to your parties. Oh, okay. Golden ginseng, eye of the tiger, firestone, jeez! Sand tea, that sounds gross. Okay, okay. Do you buy things? Can I sell this to you? Oh, hell yeah. What else do I have for you? That is all. Oh, I can go up. Wait a minute. Hello. Sometimes there's like boxes in here you could collect. I don't know if there's any here, but. There wasn't the other one, the one in, uh... ah, there wasn't any here. The one in, um, ah! <laughs> it's okay. There wasn't the one in Portia, so. Okay, cool! I don't know why I think I've ran by that thing a million times, but I've never noticed it's there. There's the station. Oh, is this one of their houses? Oh! I, oh, I know where I am. Hello. Hello. I have met a couple of people from the Flying Pigs before. They were getting their planes from Vega 5. I think all senior members of their guild have their own planes. I don't think, have we ever met this guy? Bye. Bye. I love you. Can I have some of your grapes? Well, that was an adventure. Because I'm dumb and never realized that that was actually a place to visit. I have a feeling I had been there, though. Because I put these trees down. I remember that. I remember that challenge. But I remember we played in August of last year. And then I didn't come back until, like, December. So it probably happened somewhere in between there. And I just lost it. Alright. It's getting late. 
Let's see what happens when I... I don't want that milk. I'm hoping that means I will give them five milks. Hmm, I don't see mint very often. Hmm. Mint is another one I would have loved to romance. Gus has to be nuts. Wearing a suit in this weather? Oh, don't tell him I said that. Hey! Hey, Mint! Don't talk about my hubby that way. He can wear whatever he wants. He looks nice. See you. Better believe I'm gonna tell him what you said. I'm running home right now. Right now. Well, first I'm gonna make a pit stop here at Oaks, but... Hey! Oh, sorry. This is how bears show respect. You smell very good. Well, at least he said I smell good. Holy crap. The Oaks sniffs you. Dude. Dude! Goodbye. That's okay. I know that you're a part bear. It's all good. Just took me off guard there for a second. Oh, I can't. I can't jump no more. All right. Good job, Harry. You did a wonderful job getting me from... Oh! There's the thingy. Okay. So, add five milks. Oh, how <laughs> cute! <laughs> Bye! There goes my milk! Oh my god, that was cute! Oh, I'm doing that more because I got a lot of crap in my inventory that I don't necessarily need. Got a lot of crap in my inventory I don't need. I also need to see what I need to plant and stuff because I should be getting my planting stuff going. Okay, we have way too much hardwood, so we could probably sell that. Alright, here's the part of the game where I sit here and stare at my inventory literally for like 10 minutes trying to find everything. Ooh, we're almost ready for this. Let's put this over here. I No, I forgot I needed to read that. I bought a book and didn't read it. Okay, shrimp? Or whatever this is? Lobster, excuse me. Looks like shrimp. Also, that's another thing I should be looking at. Um, <clears throat> we haven't done any of this stuff in a while. The, I forget what they're called, but these little collectible things you find. I haven't really been doing anything with those recently, just cause, no real reason, just cause. I haven't seen scraps in a while. But then again, I actually haven't been in town in a while. Lettuce. It's currently summer, though. Yes! We're gonna plant chili peppers! I do kind of remember that now. And pumpkins. And... Cotton, I think, was what we were gonna go with. Weeds, I don't think I need. So... Also, the other thing I need to look at is these things. I don't know what these are. I feel like they're important and I have absolutely ignored them. Gone through my inventory once and I already have missed things. Um. Mucus I'll just hold on to. What is this? Corn ball. I grew that for a reason. I don't know why, but I grew I remember growing it. And yes! I hoard. Bad. 
badly in this game. Like, I I don't need half of the stuff in my inventory. But at the same time, I like to have it. I don't know why. I just do. I like to hoard it all. Um, I think that's all I can put in my inventory right now. So. But that's actually really cool, that trading post thing. I think I'll try and go back there every day and then... sell some of the stuff that I really don't need. Does that mean I have 12? I need 20. I think that's what that means. Before we go to bed, let's, uh, let's go plant these. I need to play Stardew soon. I haven't played Star- oh, I didn't need to do that. I haven't played Stardew just to the fact where I wanted to finish Porsche. Alright, uh, bedtime. Then, or, you know what? I'm gonna wait. I I'm gonna, this has got an hour, so literally a minute left. And... Oh my gosh, everyone's asleep. Oh my gosh, everyone actually goes to their bed. This is the perfect time to feed them then. Everyone but my llamas are asleep. Really quickly while I wait for this. Advanced trap. Or what it was that what it was called? Yes. Advanced trap. So I need steel. That is all I need. So three steel plates. Let's see if I can make the steel plates. I'm waiting for this, but what is it I need for steel plates? Three, what was it? Three, three times three. So nine. I guess I could get that going. Ah, oh, frick. What, what was it again? Carbon steel, yeah. Uh, you know what? Wait, I'll do it in this one. Well, wait, we'll make that and then maybe by either the end of stream or maybe I'll just hold on to it. And then we'll try and get the uh, cotton llama. Ooh, we're gonna have to go. Oh no, that's charcoal. Sorry, I was reading it wrong. We're good. We're good. Finally finished that. So this is almost done. We're literally waiting on the iron wood, which I I, I don't know. It might be done tomorrow. I couldn't couldn't tell if I had the count right because I wasn't sure I was reading it right. Good night, my love! No, not a date. Wait a minute. Let me give him a kiss. Can I, what is the group photo like? Does it change because we're married? Wait, Gus, come back. Oh my god, so cute! <laughs> so cute! Oh my god. Oh, I could change these. Oh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yes. I don't think you can... I wish... Uh, there may be a way. I don't know. But I wish you could like hang these pictures on your wall. Yes. Oh my gosh. Save. Lovely. Aren't we the cutest? Yes, we are, Gust. I know. I forgot to go buy... 
QQ bed, but it's okay. I actually don't know if that's a thing, but I am curious. <gasps> yes. Angel. Painting with Gus. Angel, I'm going out to do some painting. Oh, I want to go with you. Okay, let's go then. Let's go. Oh, go to the harbor. <laughs> Thought I was just going to auto transport us there. I actually have to. I actually have to take us there. Okay. Me and Gus going on a date together. Ish. Kind of a date. Go to the harbor. Okay. Let me pick up this poo real quick. Let's take Harry. Let's pet Harry. Then we will go with him. No! He is not Hornsby. Not at all. Gus didn't look at my window to try to get my love. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I always do that. Gus is my hubby. He can say whatever he wants. Where am I going? I know it's at the harbor, but I don't... <laughs> Where's the harbor? Oh, this is the harbor. Okay. I got you. It's this way. Gus and me go... I don't know if I'm going to be painting. Oh, harbor. Duh. I don't go this way very often. Does it show on the mini map where it wants me to go? Yes. Oops. Oops. Over this way. This place looks nice. Why don't you stand in front of me? Strike a, Strike a pose! It's okay. I'll just wait until you're done. Sorry, I'm just gonna wander around. No! Oh, cause I sure. Okay. I's nervous. Oh, Harry wants to paint instead. G uh, Gus, Harry wants to paint, so let him paint. You know, he's like a child. Maybe I should stay with oh. Gus for a while. I want to stay with Gus. Sorry, I didn't know I actually had to stand here and wait. <laughs> fine, fine. We'll stand here and wait. Accompany Gus. Angel, I go to Atara for work sometimes. You take care of yourself at home. Of course. I lived without you for a while. I could take care of myself, but I will miss you dearly. Okay, I'll wait. I'll wait. Apparently, we have to. What does it say? Accompany Gus. Okay. I wait. Can I go over here? No! It doesn't even let me like walk over there and beat up some animals while I wait. Okay. I guess I'll just wait. I'll watch. Okay. There we go. What? Oh, that is actually what he's painting too. I'm sad it wouldn't actually let me. I, I don't know. Uh, did I select like the wrong thing? Oh, he's ready to talk. Uh, All done. It's absolutely gorgeous. Oh, we're done. All right, bye, guys. Thank you so much for the fun day. I'm sad it wouldn't actually let me say yes to that question he had, but it's okay. It's all okay. Now I don't know what I was gonna do today. Ah, I know. I was gonna finish my thing. Ah, cows. Moo! Okay, so yeah, I, I don't remember. Can we buy horses? No, you can ride horses. For sale! Oh my gosh, Maddie, you scared the entire room. That is a lot of money! But they are for sale! And I would like all the animals possible. But, oh, I'm sorry, Taser, I know. I know, she scared all of us because she jumped. Only 50, I want the white one. White horses are so beautiful. Uh, 15,000. I have a lot of money, but you know what? I'm going to do that a little bit later because we just got our llama. And I don't know if I need a certain stable for them. I have to look into it. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, Harry. 
But that is how you do it. Oh, that's right. Sometimes it glitches out and won't let you do that. So, I'm going to try and remember to go over to that hotel every day so we can do that whole sand rock thing. No, I will feed them at night when they're all in their thing sleeping so that it's a little easier to click. Oh no, did I pet the same one? There we go. Now, this is like Stardew now. I have so much to do before my day starts and then by the time my day starts, it's like halfway through the day. Okay, is this done? 18, fudge. Fudge, you telling me I'm too short? See if I stuffed some in here anywhere. Ah, no! That's too short! That sucks. Okay, I gotta go get... I don't know what I needed. I thought I was gonna be able to finish it. Where is that? There it is. I thought I was going to be able to finish it today. Um, hardwood I think I can sell. Yes. And everything else I can keep in my hands. But I will go back over to that trading post and see if, uh... I think it said, if I was reading it right, I think it said it would change every day to things, like, that are in demand, so... Actually, really quickly, let's go put this picture on our wall that I guessed painted because it's so beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Is there a way to like change like the wallpaper? Yeah. Love it. My house is so weird. I don't know why Gust buried me and moved in with me. My house is so weird. Anyway. Let's go um, see what we need for literally two more pieces of iron wood. I think it was mucus. Oh, it's both. So two mucuses, eight pieces of iron wood. Okay. Let's take Lloyd today. Now we have a choice. Oops. <laughs> That's not where I wanted to go, but okay. I'm just going to get extra just in case. Sophie? No, that's her. See, I told you she looks just like her. But I am gonna go over to her thing real quick and see if there is. Oops. Lobster claw. What is that for? All right, let's go in here and see if there's anything to do. And then, go get a little bit more ironwood. What did I say, eight? Oh, oh, it's a weekly thing. Oh, wow, boo. Does this change? What is this? A 
handheld cutting relic tool used by lumberjacks or craftsmen. It cuts wood much faster than an axe. Wait, hold the attack button for continuous attack. Wait, can I actually not use it for, for actually cutting down trees? I want it. <laughs> I want it. I have plenty of money to buy that horse, by the way. I want to see if this, can I use this chainsaw? On a tree? If not, that's okay. I will totally attack things with my chainsaw too. I'll be Bubba. Oh, where's my animal? Where's my, are you on here? No. Where's my Lloyd? I've cut down like all the trees though, that sucks. Now they're all kind of far away from me. All right, let's go over here and see if I can. I, I have a feeling I can't, but I'm gonna see. Oh my gosh, I can! It's a little bit of a weird animation though. Yo! <laughs> Girl's got a chainsaw. Let's go. Hi. I'm going to make a name for myself one day. I like I'll her. Become the richest woman in the free cities. The next Musa. Goodbye. Goodbye. Wait. Tree. Tree. I gotta chainsaw this thing. It is just kind of a weird animation, though. Damn, though, is it faster than an axe? Uh, oh, I forgot already what I said. Um, eight, right? I got ten. So, nah. I was gonna say, so I could probably put this axe away and never have to use it again, but I don't really need to pull my chainsaw out if I'm just doing, like, the little bushes. So I think I need to look into what it, what does it take to get a horse on your farm? Do they go in a certain spot? Maybe I'll go tomorrow to, what day is it? Wednesday, okay, they'll be open. Uh, A and G and see if there's like a, another building I need to build. Good job, Lloyd. I love you. You're my number one love. Don't have a guess to that, but you are my number one. All right, that'll be done. Why was I making this? Oh, I remember. I remember. What was it called? Yeah. So that one thing. Y'all know. Oh, there's Remington. I haven't talked to Remy in a while. You know who we haven't seen today? We haven't seen Arlo around. But then again, I really haven't been in town barely at all. Time is it 18? Yeah, I wanted to go actually look at some things, but everything is close. Yo -yo! You're welcome. Actually, I am gonna go look at something that is open. <gasps> There's scraps. Let's see what else he likes that's a little more than that, but it's okay. Okay. Oh, Gust is here. Hi, Gust. No, me first, Gust. 
Uh, it was here that I bought Pinky's thing. Oh, can I not buy it again? How do you have kids in this game? Can you have kids in this game? Because you can buy, like, little kid things. I just wait and see. How's it going? How's your day going, Blossom? You having a good day? Thank you, Brad, for giving Blossom a shout out. I can't buy another bed and or it's not available at the moment. Apology bear, a cute bear doll that can help ease relationship tension between cus uh, customers, couples. Well, you know what? I should have had that when I screwed up with Arlo, but it's okay. It's okay, me and Gus. Hey, Gus, do you want to play this with me? Ah. <laughs> Yes, let's go. Perfect game. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was just doing that to pass the time. Um, <gasps> Dr. Zhu. Hey, I like herb gathering. Sometimes I get a little surprised when a little bug falls from the tree leaves. I give them to Chiwa as a gift. <laughs> oh, Chiwa? That's how you see his name? I call him Kiwa. Hi, Ginger! You okay, Tazar? I heard that. Do I have anything for you? You want some seaweed? I don't think so. Ginger! Hello. I haven't been able to meet the flying pig member yet. Oh, that's right. They don't have a I lot of... I heard she's really tough. They don't have a lot of dialogue. Kind of depends on what's going on in the game. Alright, that was... That was that. Have baby milk powder. Hey, Gust! <laughs> Where are you? Gust! I know we have a lot of animals, but we could possibly have a baby! Gust's like, <laughs> run away! That's got an hour and a half. I'll wipe that out because then we will finish the lift. Is that what I was gonna do? Yeah. No, I was gonna do Dana's thing. We'll, we'll do hers next, obviously, but we're gonna do Dana's things next. I actually don't know which one progresses the story. Gust's birthday's coming up. Ooh, we have to play in something special for Gust. All right, let's go feed our animals. It's nighttime. They got enough. I don't want to add an animal. 16 of 30. Oh, they like seaweed. Perfect. I don't know where I got that seaweed, but perfect. Um, while I wait that hour and a half, I'm going to go cut down some stuff for plant fibers. Then I think I might take one quick break here in between the days. So I am having to use the restroom for a minute. I missed. I missed. Got it. This has got like a stranger's thing sound to it. Oh, is that Kiwa or whoever? Antoine desires something. Uh oh. Hold on, be right back. I gotta go see what Antoine desires, because I like doing this. Oh, he's asleep. Never mind, we'll have to ask him tomorrow. If he's in the apartments at this time, he's... Your cue's stuck. He's probably sleeping, so we'll wait till tomorrow. This is done. Let's go. Uh, finally. I shouldn't say finally. I don't know really how long it's been taking us, but 
I remember this stuff was a long time coming. Yay! All right, tomorrow we will deliver this. Oh, yes. I, whenever I get to work on it, I will show you, but it's a secret. It's a secret. All right. I'm going to wake up. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pause it. I'm going to use the restroom and just take a quick break, stretch, do all that kind of good stuff, make sure everything's going good in the household. And then we'll go back to Porsche, play that for the rest of the day, and enjoy the chill. I'm all tangled up in my cord here. Enjoy the chill variety Friday. So if the mods want to put a bunch of shoutouts in chat for you guys to enjoy all the amazing clips by some amazing people, they may. I will be back in just a couple minutes. Girl's got a big old ass. I got that honky tonk, but don't get tonk. Hey, wildfire! Oh my god, I thought you had no pants on. <laughs> I was about to oh god! Please let me the fuck out. Oh. Why? No, 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 no. It's like a dream within a dream within a fucking. <laughs> fucking piece of shit! <laughs> oh, God. I'm gonna take this out in case he's a no ed player. trade with you. It's a creep kid. All alone. Can I smell your hair? Oh, whoa. Whoa, the exorcist. Not good. <laughs> and thank you so much for all the <laughs> shot. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> gifting giving brad a shout out and getting my favorite clip i love it <laughs> and thank you for all the shout outs for all the amazing content creators and keeping everyone entertained while i was stepped away for one moment you are too a streamer you are too shush listen to blossom shush what am i doing oh continue my game that's what i'm doing I have not seen that clip in a while. It had not popped up in quite a while. Let's talk Pinky. Angel. That's not Pinky. It's okay. Oh, I... <laughs> I was gonna give Gus a massage, but okay, I'll take it. That got your stamina up? Oh, cool. By only one, but... I'll take it. I will never understand how it is your favorite. <laughs> But I'll never delete because it makes you smile. I know it is ma one of Magic's favorites too. It's not just me. 
It is also one of Magic's favorites, I remember her saying. I just watch an anime and you? Nice! Sounds like a good day. I hope everyone out there is having a good day, by the way. I hope everyone's having fun whatever with whatever they are doing. I'm just chilling in Portia, progressing my life in Portia. Um, today we are going to start that next, whatchamacallit, that I'm supposed to be building, and then we're also going to go deliver the slift to wherever the hell it's supposed to go. Definitely, definitely, I agree. And one more thing before I get really going. If you guys have not noticed, I do have a Discord open now if you guys want to join in on the fun. Lots of good stuff going on over there. Share it. Share it with your friends. Spread the good word. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but do what you want. Is that my game? What the hell is that noise in my game? Oh, it might have been the music. My bad. Sorry. <laughs> that was my game. Um, let's see. What do I gotta do here? What do I gotta put away? I've got so much crap in my inventory yet again. So, that one thing said weekly, by the way. For the trading post? I wonder what it means by weekly. Like, is it from the week I did it? Or kind of like the other thing? Monday through... Monday through Monday. Oh, this is just me and my inventory again. I really wish. You know what? I should do all this off stream. I should like get in this game, spend one day on this game and rearrange my inventory. But actually now I'm kind of happy that I've, I've got almost 300 discs. I don't even know what to use these for anymore. There might be some way to use them. I don't know. Um, but anyways, um, that trading post thing seemed like it would change to the things you could use. And if that's the case, that's actually really cool that I've been hoarding because I can put the stuff into that. Oh, so far it was only like milk I saw, but I don't think I have these things. Uh, what was I doing with this? Keep forgetting. Oh, never mind. I remember. Mucus can go there. Everything else. Actually, wait a minute. This stuff currently in my hand, I don't need because I was carrying it because I kept having to put it into the llamas thing and I finished that for now. We'll do some more llamas later, but oopsie, but right now. This I have to sell, this I keep in my hand. My fish is actually in my hand because I've been giving it to Kinky. Everything else can stay in my hand except for the shrimp that's considered lobster. Okay, done. I mean, I should have waited till I went and did all my animal stuff. First, let's do this. Install the lift. Aluminum alloy frame. Let's get that going. Assuming it's on station two. Aluminum alloy frame. Concrete? Ooh. Ooh, what is this? Farm in the quarry? Oh no, I don't think I have that, but we'll have to go see. Um, what is, okay. We'll do that. We'll start that. I'll look at that here in a bit. Let me check on my animals. I don't think I can pet them when they're like that because it just doesn't let you. Oops. I fought with them on the phone a minute ago because they wanted my appointment. Oh, on a Wednesday because that's stream day. 
Be like, no, I work that day. That's what you tell them. You say, I, I have to be at work that day. Oh, wait, that then they might be like, you have a job? Like, wait, never mind. I have prior engagements that day. There we go. That's what you tell them. <laughs> Believe me, I actually know that feeling. Like, sometimes when I'm making appointments for things, it's like, how about Monday? I'm like, nope. I'm busy on Monday. I was busy on Monday. Like, with my dog's appointment, unfortunately, I had to make it on Tuesday, and I was like, mm, darn it. Lost some streams on Tuesdays. I don't want to, I don't want to miss it. But that was like, she was like, Monday or Tuesday? And I'm like, fine, Tuesday. Fine. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> Scatterbrain, just a minute. I was going to go do something, and then I need to do this first. I need to make some, uh, soil. God, there's so much I want to do. I got to go make some soil or fertilizer or not soil. Um, I got to do something else I remember, but I don't. Gotta go talk to Antoine. I need more animal bones. Oh, this does not take that long. I always leave and it takes like two seconds. What else did I need to do today? Holy crap. I hate games like this that I want to do so much and then by the time the day comes, I've totally lost it. gonna let me pet this person I don't know which one I've got nope ah uh, we've got Harry okay that's fine first ugh, my soda's giving me the hiccups I hate it no we're gonna go over here first <laughs> I just have to yell at Nora on my way by Gus does that work so nice of him bringing in the money for us hey why don't I Gust's paycheck. Oh my god, I can upgrade the assembly station? I won't right now, but I wonder what would happen if I upgraded it. Okay, so there's nothing extra. I have a coop, I have a shed, I have a stable. So the horses must go into the stable if I bought them. And maybe I will go buy one just to see what it's like. <clears throat> but I think I'll wait for a little bit because I just got my second llama. But there is, in fact, no other no other uh, housing thing to do. Oh, I can't gift him anything? Why? Oh, did I already gift him something today, technically? All right. Gust. I will leave. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have bothered you at work. Nora. Actually, I'm going to go bother. Not Nora, but I'm going to go see what this is. Harvest Nitrate? <gasps> All seasons. I'm going to... Needs a large planter box. I'm going to grab this. Because I actually need that. Well, I really want to buy this stuff. I'm going to spend all my money. I'm going to have to do jobs. <laughs> I'm going to have to do some jobs. I'm spending all this money. What is this? Flooring. That's what I wanted to do. Thank you, Nora. Yes, I said thank you to Nora. I wanted to go over here to these shops and see if there's things I can buy. Because I could buy some of this stuff to upgrade my house to make it look a little nicer. What is this? Burning a fish shape? No, that's not a fish. That looks like a ghost. But uh, I won't probably buy this stuff now, but this is things I could buy from my house. I do really think one day when we stream, we will, like, focus on nothing but upgrading our house. Uh, this is just clothes, right? Yeah. Well, clothes and other things. I 
do like my outfit, but I think I might change. It's been a while! We've been wearing the same thing over and over. Let's go see if we can steal from this guy. Oh, he's trying to grab his stuff. Alright, um... Oh, wait. Deliver the lift. Where? Ah! Over there! Okay. Let's just take the DD stop. It'll be faster. Let's go. Back! Welcome back, Magic! How's your day going? Everything going good today? S or still going good? I know I already asked, but still going good? I'm lost. Which way do I go? This way? Yes. Right around here somewhere. Oh! I passed it. Wait a minute. Where? Oh, I see it. Okay. Boom! Oh, can I ride this now? Let's go, Harry. Let's see what's up here. And Harry, go on an adventure together. Oh my gosh, I unlocked more of the map! Nice! I'm working so meh. Understandable, understandable. Well, what time is it? It's almost four magic. It's getting very close. So, no, don't worry about it. We're, you're almost there. It's almost the weekend. Final countdown. Wow, it's pretty up here. I see absolutely nothing, so I kind of think maybe later, maybe something will, will do something up here. Meaning, like, put something in. But right now, there's currently nothing, but it's pretty. I'm trying to make so that was actually probably pretty good that we did that first I might be able to get this somewhere else too but currently this is what I need so I'll just get it from here oh I gotta talk with Molly or Mally I don't know how you say her name I don't know where she is and I don't know how much of the stuff I need so I'm just gonna grab a whole bunch of it let's go oops Yes. Oh, wait. Yes. And then it's drinking and DVD until D&D &D tonight. Oh, that sounds like a good night. That sounds like food. You miss playing D&D, Chuck? I've never played. It's not really my style of thing, though, but I do enjoy when I can. I love watching Magic play on her channel, and then any, anybody else that I've seen play, I've enjoyed watching. But it's not... I, I can't get into things like that for myself, but I do enjoy watching it. Yeah, Magic is usually off at 5, five oh, p.m. our time, I mean. I, oh, every time, every time Magic says she's on her drive home, I know there's about an hour left to stream. It's like my uh, hour reminders when Magic's on her way home. I have 27. I think I'll finish these two rocks and then I will head home, but I don't remember really how many I needed, so better safe than sorry to grab a bunch. Harry, watch out. 
Harry's new to the family. He might not understand when I'm swinging a pickaxe and not get in my way. All right, how the hell do I get out of here? Where the hell is the lift? Must be this way. Uh, it's a ton of fun being able to base, being able to create stories based off of nothing pretty much is insane and addicting. I can see definitely the, ah! Oh, sorry, I thought I was gonna fall. I didn't realize that was a thing and then when I realized it, I was trying to get on it. And then it left, there we go. But yeah, I, I can definitely see the addiction, to, or I wouldn't say addiction, but you know what I mean, the, the, uh, Whatever. Me and words don't get along. But, um, the joy and everything in it. I, I can see definitely all that. Me, I've said this on stream like a bunch of times. For some reason with me, when it comes to trying to stream... Where am I? <laughs> when I'm trying to stream things like that, my creativity leaves. And I don't know what it is. I, I, it might be maybe just like a anxious thing. I don't know. But anytime I have to do something super creative when it comes to like making up a story or something, I struggle when it's on stream. And that's one reason I kind of stopped playing The Sims. It's because I could not get that creativity with creating families and stories and all that for my Sims. And so I need eight more ironwood planks. Oh my God, I hate them so much. Um, but yeah, it, I, I love like off stream. When I'm playing Sims, and I'm using this as an example because it's the thing I play the most, I can create this backstory and it's amazing things for my, my Sims that I've either created or who were born, you know, into families I've had for generations. And I can just roll with it. But then it came to stream and I'm just like, here's my Sim. Yeah, this is her. <laughs> and I could never give you guys like an interesting story or anything like that. So that's why I don't really focus on things like that. Ooh, you're working on something for your main character's backstory. Nice, nice. I try and catch uh, D and D and everything that Magic streams. Sometimes it goes a little bit later at night, so sometimes I fall asleep. But I try and watch as much as possible because I do find it very interesting. Because it may come up at some point. Ooh. Oh yeah, I'm right. Is that what you were writing about when you said on Discord? I'm writing about how she watched her parents get killed. Is that what you, cause I heard uh, you said, I think somewhere in Discord. Like I said, I get lost sometimes when I'm on Discord with <laughs> Surfer. <laughs> but um, I remember you said you were getting back into writing. But in game, it's not known. Yeah, nice, nice. I'm glad you're getting back into writing magic. I remember we were talking about that on stream recently. Not only getting back into writing, but also reading and stuff like that. But that's where that's where that kind of conversation had come from. Was okay. That's done. Uh, like I said, I can write things off offline too. Like I can come up with stories and um, you know whatever I feel like writing. But if I was, pre no, I would say pressured, but if I was supposed to do it for a reason, like when I was in school, I had to write, you know, like stories for school and they never came out good or I didn't think they came out good and they were harder to do because I was forced to do them. But then when I can sit down by myself alone and do it, I can come up with like amazing stuff, which would kind of work with sometimes D&D &D and all those kind of things like that because you can write those off of stream, obviously. But I still, I forget how many I needed. I'll just make five, I think that was the number. I still struggle. Is that supposed to be an hour? Oh, seven hours, okay. But I do, I really do enjoy writing. I need to get back into it, like off stream a little bit more. It was five. Five aluminum plates, six hard aluminum. Same with reading, but I think I said this on stream recently too, was the reason I don't do a lot of reading is because I wait for the fall months in California when our power company shuts the power off for safety. 
and then I'm sitting around my house having absolutely nothing to do. I save all my reading for then because then I can get a lot of it done because I've got literally maybe two days. Two days of having to do nothing but read. I forgot how many I needed. Five plates. Okay, I need five plates. Four plates. Four times three is twelve. Take away one. Eleven. Eleven stainless aluminum. I forget where to make that. Here. Okay. So I can't make that right now. So I need eleven though. Hopefully I will not at all remember that. But it's okay. Fudge. I forgot to go visit Antoine. Ugh, I forgot to go visit Antoine and see what he wanted. It's okay. Well, I would like to work on my confidence to try and write something to be published. I, 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 I totally feel that. I totally feel that because I think anything I write is absolutely trash. But you know what, Magic? I believe you can do it. I totally believe you can do it. And I know it's hard though because believe me, I, I suffer from the same thing. I don't like sharing what I write. I don't like think it's ever good. But I'm the same way. I would love to like work up that that confidence in order to try and not only even publish but post it in the discord for you guys and thank you magic for posting the discord link if you ever ever anybody out there who has artwork or writing or anything you guys can post it in the discord if you feel comfortable if you don't no pressure but post it over in the discord and we will we will read it but i know i know i know that feeling i have never had the confidence to ever really not even publish but sh share with anybody everything i've ever written was always well i mean other than school projects and stuff like that have always been i've kept to myself i've never whoops i've never shared but i would like to get back into writing just because i do want to get back into it just for myself because it has been very long time i couldn't even put a date just long so there was a couple things i needed i needed bones so i'll have to go find those i needed something else that i already forgot what it was but i will when we need it i'll go look again but this game is getting in depth man there's things i need that i didn't even know existed in this game so can i how do i change my clothes oops that's not how Aha, no. Oh, I have a skill point. Oh, here's how I do it. What does this look like on me? Oh, cute! Oh my god. Actually, I mean, I like the bottoms, but I think this, I mean, not the shoes necessarily, but this looks cute. Oh my gosh i like my hat but oh my gosh i am beautiful <laughs> i am beautiful i don't like the shoes i wish i could change the shoes but that's okay i'm beautiful i'm gonna go with this look i'm gonna miss this shirt but we'll come back to it uh i would like some different head thing but this will work for right now let me go um mm, skill point i don't do a lot of fighting Let's put some into our gathering. Let's put on this one. Yes! If anyone needs an editor, hit me up. I do have plenty of experience searching books out there now with my name as an editor. Nice! I didn't know that! That's freaking awesome! But yeah, if anyone ever needs an editor, reach out to SK. Wow, look at all those dino emotes. Holy crap. Pumpkin pie with a piece of garlic cheese bread. I'm trying to picture it. I don't know. I don't know if I would enjoy that together. <laughs> Maybe? 
Then again, don't know until you try. French toast. Ew, no, bot! <laughs> French toast with a lot of anchovies on top. No! Ruin my French toast! One of my best friends is a published author. I have been editing her book since her first one, and we are working. Oh, and we're working on book 14 now. That is freaking awesome. What kind of books, by the way? Like, what, what's the, like, genre? Genre? Style? Whatever. What kind of books? I am gorgeous. I love my outfit. Oopsie. I don't think I have any more inventory space. I don't. <laughs> for clothes. I'm going to have to make one more box for clothes. Because uh, I have to have things as organized as possible. Um, okay, well, what am I making? I would need to make my thing look nice. I would need the, the, the bigger one. So let's go see what I need to make that. Where is it? I don't know. This game doesn't have a search button. Not in there. I don't know where it is. I don't know where it is. Polly, hello! How are you doing today? I love the outfit. Why, thank you. Same friend is, oh, same friend is Elfie's co-mom. She's the one that adopted her for me for Christmas. Oh, how adorable. <gasps> murder mystery. I love murder mysteries. Hey, hey, drop me. Uh, you can put it in Discord or DM me the, the names of like either the author or the books or something. And I'm going to look those up. I freaking love murder mysteries, so. Thank you, Brad, for giving Poet a shout out. Me, or not me and Poet, but Poet finally figured out where her hidden, hidden uh, clips were. I'm super proud of her because I know she was looking for them. And I don't know why Twitch was hiding them, but they were. No, it's okay. You can probably shout her out now because we, we, we figured it out. We got, we got the, we got them gone or she got them gone. I should say I did nothing. <laughs> she figured it out though. So it's all good. I'll link you to her page on Amazon. There we go. That'll work. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, SK. I will check those out because I love murder mysteries. I'm trying to finish my drink. There we go. But the funny thing is when Poet was saying that, she was saying how she had like these clips that were not showing up but were like hiding deep in Twitch somewhere. Like the, the next week, I think, I saw someone on Twitter say the same thing. Like, they had these clips that kept showing, and they could not find them for the life of them. And I don't know if they ever figured it out or not, but I just remember somebody saying that. I was like, oh, I remember Poet saying that. Like, there were these hidden clips on her channel. It's, uh, bronze plate strength and glass. And, you know, Twitch, Twitch be twitchy. I don't know. Twitch does things sometimes. And I can't figure out what they're doing. One day, four hours. Uh, I can't do the one thing because it's currently being used. Go feed our animals because they are all in bed. They're okay for now. Ooh, I should check my llamas. They don't go to bed and I kind of forget. 26 of 30. They are good. I forgot to pick up their poo this morning. Thirty of thirty, good. All right, we can go to bed now. I think uh, there might have been something else I was supposed to do, but I don't remember. So I'm going to bed. Ah, my second screen. Excuse me. There we go. Thank you. Let me go to bed and I'll read chat. <laughs> Brad is now taking my bat and he's hitting me with it. <laughs> because that was a nightmare to find and it sounded like it. I remember you explaining what you did to find that and that's, that's not cool. That's not cool that Twitch, 
that Twitch, I don't want to say hides them, but that you have to go through such a freaking process just to find them. And I wish I could remember who it was because um, I saw it before I think you had told me that you had figured it out. So I don't even remember who it was so that I could say something to him. A prom! But you can't time me out, Brad. Time out infinity? No. I am, I am in, wait, wait, not infinity. I am invincible here. All right, l uh, let me go get my props real quick. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. I think on the screen I can't. You can't see them. No, let me go. I'm gonna switch screens real quick. We can see them better on here. So these are my props here, right here <laughs> that I'm looking at. <laughs> and do you want to pick one poet, or do you want to just put? Let me put whatever, whatever. I've got like the cute little octopuses. I've got these masks, anywhere from like a kitty. It's not a kitty, but these. Oops. To a couple DVD ones, to a crown. But if you don't care, I will pick whatever. You let me choose? Okay, okay, that's totally fine. What do we want to wear? What have I not worn yet? I don't think I've worn the kitty one. Kind of fits with my ears, so. I'm trying to make it big so my ears are blocked. Ah, it's just gonna be dull. I'm gonna have double the ears, it's okay. There we go. Wait. There we go. All right, that'll be my mouse. For, I don't know how long. We'll just put on as long as I feel like it or until I forget. <laughs> Usually I wear it like in DVD for like two, three matches, but on Variety Fridays I have no time frame. So we will wear this mask for Poet for until I forget. <laughs> I, you know what? I should get one of those just because that would be funny. I should get one of those. I don't have currently one of those for that, but I should get one because I wouldn't mind that. I really could care less what it prop I have. I have like the, I have the toxic emote on there in case I feel like I'm being toxic. I can just put on my face and be like, watch out. Girls be toxic today. And then I'm just gonna put the toxic emote on my face. But I need to, that would be actually kind of funny if I had like the poo, a poo like emoji or something. Ah, I was like, what am I doing? I'm trying to give her a fish. You're welcome, Pinky. I kind of ignore Pinky since QQ moved in. QQ! What was it? Oh, it was Animal Crossing. I was like, what is it the other day we were talking about? Angel. Having poo on my head. And it was the Animal Crossing. I don't remember what the item was. Angel, you're back. I haven't left, but thank you. Um, where the outfit looked like poo on my head. Ghost! You like my new outfit? It's just for you. Oh. Love you too, guys. Have a wonderful day at work. I have no idea what I'm doing today, but we are going to be doing something. I'll be right around seeing what I can find. Then we can call you little shit. <laughs> Yes, you could. Does anyone remember what I needed? Bronze plates. I have new bronze bars. Holy crap. I could have been making those ahead of time. Um, three. I think I need two. So I need six. Yes, Pinky. girl ain't refueling her stuff, so she might be getting herself in a pickle here. Nah, nah, nah. She's okay. Alright, um, let's go see. Oh, this is not done? Oh, 44 minutes. Okay, because I needed to make 11. I have to talk to Molly or Mally or whatever her name is. Where is she? <gasps> there she is. Oh, no, Antoine Desire something. No, I think that's her. Yes. Yes. Okay, uh, I'll feed the animals. Say hi to them on my way. Let's take Lloyd back because I want to catch her before she disappears. I'm sorry, I'm busy. 
<laughs> hey! It was Arlo! I haven't seen Arlo in forever. Where is she? She's up here. There she is. All right, thanks for the help. Now I can start looking at the ruins in that area. I hope it's not too dangerous. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> Hello, Ducky! How are you doing? Ah. Wow. Lloyd! Hey, can I pet you back here? Good lord, you're my favorite! I told you, don't tell Gus, but you're still number one in my heart. Okay, uh, we did that, so that'll progress whatever that story is. Um, let's go see, where did Antoine go? He's probably at work. He is at work, okay. Finally, let's go see what Antoine wants. It's Friday. We could probably pick up, like, a commission, too, because we haven't done commissions in this game in, like, frickin' forever. Hello. I would like an order of fruit salad. Ooh! Hmm. I don't know if I can make that. We'll see. Um, because, see, there's these. We're in need of a long-haul bus for the newly opened Porsche to San Rock route. This route's success is cru cru critical, not crucial. For Porsche's features, so please give it your all. Please consult with the research center if you don't know how to construct the vehicle. What if I don't want to do that right now because I'm trying to make something else? Current day six, month two. I think that's literally like in a few days. One boombox. Three waterproof cloth. Two iron pans? I don't know. I don't know what I can make on a camp egg. Let's try this one. I hope. I ain't gonna do that one because, oh yeah, it's due tomorrow. It's due tomorrow, I think. Said month two. And I haven't done it at all. Hopefully it respawns and I can do it later. I actually forgot that there were things in the commission board that were not only just commissions, but also things to progress. All right, good boy, Lloyd. I'm gonna turn home and then we'll go see what my animals are doing. We need to go beat up some animals because I need uh, bones. I didn't hey, talk to Act today. Do you need a helper? I can cook and maybe help out in the workshop. I drop by often anyway, so I might as well find an excuse to just stay at your place. I mean, that would be very helpful. Then I could do other stuff. Uh, where where do you finish? Excuse to just state your place. I do, I do need living allowances. Those glasses of milk don't come for free. Please hire me. Twelve hundred goals a month. I mean, I could actually like he could do stuff for me, and then I could actually do commissions and little things that I want to do. Sure, let's see how it goes. Ak is now your helper. Let's go. I would like to remind you that you can follow or change my schedule in the home panel on your wall. Okay. Also, a large swath of my task memory is corrupted, probably due to this hole on my head. I don't think I'll be able to perform <gasps> all the tasks you require of me at this moment. Oh, 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 oh! Petra mentioned that there are still many yeah. slots available to add data chips in my head, so. If we plug in chips with the task data of what you want me to do, I'll be able to perform it. Where can we find the data chips? I chip? have data chips! That's what those are for! Petra gave me one for storing cooking recipes. Which reminds me, you can give me new cooking recipes to remember as well. So, maybe she has more. So wait, wait, Ak. Hello? Oh, cook, okay. Uh, wait. Can you cook me? Ah, you can't. Fruit salad. Vegetable salad. Oh, he don't know fruit salad. Okay. 
Uh, so wait, how do I give those to him? I have been storing these, I told you guys, I hoard things, uh, forever. And I was like, I'm sure they have something to do with Ack. They'll come across some point. Where did I put them? Here. Cooking recipe data chip, a chip that can be added, a chip that can add some cooking recipe data to an AI's core system. Let's Ack cook this recipe, okay? Wait, how do I, can I do fastest? Yeah. Cooking chip. Agricultural chip, cooking chip, cooking chip, husbandry data chip, <laughs> a chip that can add some husbandry program to your AI's core system. Oh, activates feed animal function. Holy hell. Automated planting data chip, a chip that can add some agricultural programs for an AI's core system. Activates acts automated, automated. Mm -hmm. Auto be right back. All right, Magic, no worries. That caught me off guard there for a second. Thank you, African Bull Ducky and Magic, a shout out. These must be lazy. Oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> no! Oh! Damn it! Okay. Are you guys falling? Oh <laughs> I love that clip. Well. No magic's record with driving in video games. Uh, how? How do, do are these just like automatic? I have these like data chips for him. I wonder if I go talk to Petra because he says something about Petra. And I couldn't just. There used to be so many. AIs I can't like gift it to him, and I can't like install it. Only to be the only one here now. What happened? Yeah, well, let me gift it to him. So I wonder what this is. Wait, 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 wait. All right, well, leave me alone. No, it's not down there either. Okay, uh, I'll figure it out. Let me see. Let me do my things that I was doing, and then we will go figure that out. Um, now I'm a lost though. Oh, my concrete. Oh, my concrete. Let's take my animals. I have a one track mind. No, uh, I am not selling him. These are my animals and I love them dearly. She was. I was on the back of the motorcycle. Well, then you, I have, you know, I, I have to tell you. You should have saw it coming. <laughs> we, we all know Magic's driving skills in video games are expert. Just like my shooting in games is expert quality. Um, okay, I did that, I did that, I did that. Let's work on this for a minute, then... No, 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 no. I'm gonna, who am I gonna take? I'm gonna take you. Uh, I'm gonna go see if Pe Petra can tell me something about these chips. Cause I don't know, maybe they're just automatically since I have them on hand. They're automatic, but I'm gonna go see if Petra has something to say. I don't know, is she here? Ah, she does have something to say. Let's go. You want data chips for Ack? Sure. We have some in store from all the broken AIs we excavated. But since they're rare, they'll cost you. Um, right before I pushed that, I noticed on my HUD, or not the bottom one, but the one that tells me what I'm supposed to be doing, that it said ask Petra a question. So 
So I was supposed to be doing this and I was just dumb and not reading, which is nothing new for me, especially in this game, it seems like. I thought you was Team Brad and was gonna come say, <laughs> well, I am, but at the same time, you should have known the consequences. <laughs> That's like, if you ever play a game with me and we have to shoot something, you're gonna be doing all the shooting because ain't nothing gonna get done if I'm doing it. Actually, I've been doing better with my shooting in games, but it still needs a lot of help. I'm sorry, Petra, I wasn't listening. What'd you say? You want data chips for Axe? Sure, we have some in store for all the broken AIs we excavated, but since they're rare, they'll cost you. Ghouls? No, I don't want money. Oh, I got I data, data discs. discs. I'll give you the data chips for data discs. Oh, I got lots. Fair trade, no? You can use the cashier counter in the research center for exchanges in the future. So that didn't answer my question. I got some smoked ham. Hello? If I have them on my hand, does that mean that they're currently in my, like, like, Axe database or something? Or do I have to give them to him? Maybe I can give them to him now. More data disks? Thanks. In exchange, let me give you some of our research notes. You can use them on your own factory to gain extra attributes. Oh, I was just curious what machines. this did. I have so freaking many data disks now. So what'd she say I could go here? There's nothing here. Maybe later. Okay, well, let me see. Is there anything else to do? No, there's not, okay. Maybe I can go put them inside? <laughs> now, I don't know. I'm impressed you have been doing better. I have been doing a little better. I will totally admit it. We played, uh, what? The last thing I played on stream was Resident Evil, and I actually did a little bit better. But I have been playing, um, Fallout 4 off stream, which is shooting. And haven't done too bad. I mean, I definitely could improve, but at the same time, I think I've done pretty good. Nah, that's not what I wanted. Um, let's see. I never went upstairs and got my concrete, I don't think. That's how one track my mind is. I'm trying to make... Alright, I'm waiting for that. Let me go up here and get this. Uh, Axe's not here at the moment, so I can't really ask him what it... What I do now. But I hired him! Where is he?! Why am I doing all this work? It's fine. I can do it. Just ask. Um, okay, so this was currently finished. And I do remember. I need 11 of these. I can only make five. Okay. Because I'm missing aluminum ore now. Uh, we have to go to the desert for that one. Okay. So, probably tomorrow in game we'll go to the desert. Because we also need to get more of that wood, more mucus, and the hard aluminum is done. So I can put that on here. Also, I need to see- I thought I could make fruit salad. I think I can. For Antoine. I have to do this twice, I just realized, but it's okay. I will do it all when it comes- to needing it for the second one. I'm assuming if I- if, if Ak didn't know it, I don't know it. I don't. Salad sauce and lettuce, okay. So what I like to do is a lot of the times in this game when they- if I don't have the dish that is being requested or whatever, I like to try and guess. Because sometimes I can look at old ones, like, you know, spaghetti with hot sauce, and kind of guess. So, it was fruit salad. I don't know what kind of fruits off the top of my head are in this game. I'll have to go back and look. But, if vegetable salad is just lettuce and sauce, I'm going to think fruit salad is possibly one fruit and a sauce? 
that's gonna be a pure guess. I'm gonna go see what kind of fruits I have, because I really don't know. I've got a lot of different crap. Welcome back, Magic! I would take you to a shooting game any day. I think you have learned enough to cover things. I think I probably have. I don't know if I would be g great at it, but I think I could handle myself now. Charlotte's mom's birthday. I'll tell her you're on the way to take her shopping so I can sleep in. <laughs> there you go, right? Well, you know what? Since I'm not on tomorrow, even though I'll be around tomorrow, maybe, I plan on it. Tell your mom happy birthday from me. Hush. Oh, half an hour. Only half more hour magic. It's a weekend! I have not seen Papa Bear in a while. I have not gone to visit. Um, where is my... Here it is. So my inventory is getting full because I'm waiting for Act to come back. But at the same time, I... Let me put this up here. I could probably hold on to some of this stuff. Uh, you know what? I really... Mm, I make... I was gonna make another chest. I'm just gonna put this in here. And I'm gonna put this here. Because I won't need it now. Okay. There we go. What... What time is it? 15... There is a DD stop. I'm gonna run. I was gonna look at the fruit. That's my. That's how bad my memory is. I was looking at fruit. Uh. Where's my food? Well, I have a lot of different things could be classified as fruit. I have apples. Do I not actually have any salad sauce? Oh, never mind. I was actually gonna try like apples and salad sauce and see if that's what it would be. Cause there's also apricots I think in this game maybe. Snakeberry, that probably wouldn't be it. My guess would be an apple. But I don't, I also have dried apricots, so it could be that too. It could, instead of be salad sauce, it could be maybe a bunch of fruits. I don't know. I will just kind of forget about it for right now because I don't want to do it. Well, I mean, I do want to do it, but I don't want to do it. But it's not number one high on my list and it's not that important. I forgot I have a commission, just a minute. I told you guys, my brain, it don't work. Ten. Oh my god, ten. He needs three. I need thirty. Oh my lord, that's so much. I have nine days. Okay, I have plenty of time. Okay. Holy hell, I don't have half the stuff for thirty of those, but we'll get it. We will get it. Let's see if you took her shopping, it would be a ton of thrift stores. It's her fave thing. Thrift stores are fine. I like thrift stores. Is this the... Abandoned ruins? My town is all thrift stores. <laughs> That's like the one thing we have like a million of, I feel like. Oh, that's the frame. How do I? Oh, is this how I get in here? No. Oh, it's over here. Okay, I got it. Never mind. I think this is where I need to be for right now. Mine up. Wait, is this not where I need to be? Wait. Hold up. What did it? Oh, I'm not. Oh, no. No. I don't need any. I don't know what it is. Maybe this is the place. I don't know. Abandoned Ruins 2. Oh, I need... Over here. 
I need to be over here. I didn't bring my lava. I'm not in the right spot. This is not where I need to be. It's getting too late though. I'll probably just have to go home. I don't know why I thought it was down here, but that's okay. I like the flea markets because you bargain, bargain them down. Oh no! I was trying to read the next part of the, or the first part of that sentence and then I fell off the lift. It's okay. Anyways, my sister's wanting her to come up to her house and plant garden all day for birthday, but how much fun would that be? An all day thing? I don't think that would be a lot of fun. I don't mind planting and stuff, but uh, all day? No, I'm good. It's gonna take 47 minutes. I might miss what that is. Cause I don't, I don't mind planting and doing garden stuff, but at the same time, I could only do it for so long. Quick, help me gather some fireflies. Okay. What exactly happened? Look over there. <gasps> Look over there! Where? Ah! Oh! Boomba! That thing was cute. That thing's been rampaging through the farm for the hey. last two nights. The fields are all messed up by it. I feel so angry. I'm sorry. She's like, I feel so angry, but she sounds so sweet at the same time. From what I've seen, it loves fireflies. It seems to be randomly chasing fireflies throughout my farm. So, I'm trying to gather some fireflies to lead it away. Will you help me? It's really late. I'm sorry. I'm tired. No, I'll do it. Sure, I always wanted to catch fireflies. Kind of. What do I do? Ah, catch. I was really hoping there would be something like a little harder than just walking up to him, like literally having to chase him. But okay. Be enough. Here, put them in this jar here. And That's what I wanted to do. Here. I wanted to like take the jar and like run around and chase them. Oh my god, adorable. Boomba, follow. He's so cute. Uh, sorry, we're having an intimate moment here, it looked like. Emily, be careful! Don't worry, he doesn't seem aggressive. He really does love fireflies. If we can find his nest and give him this jar, he'll probably not return to the farm. No! No, 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 no! Let him return to the farm! Oh, okay, maybe not my crops and stuff, sure, but you know what? He can come visit me anytime. It's getting late. I'll take the jar and search for his nest tomorrow. Yeah, it's late. I don't know what time it is. But okay. He probably lives in the woods around here. Go get some sleep. Thanks for the help. No problem. That was kind of fun. I wish it was a little more challenging, but... Is this still Antoine? Yeah. Fruit salad. I don't know how... Wait, Ack, come back. Upgrade. Yes. Oh, look at that! I'm only missing technically, I guess. One, two, three, four, five. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Can you cook fruit salad now? Are these in alphabetical order? No. I didn't notice if that had actually given him more recipes. <gasps> no, he could make vegetable salad. Maybe not. Okay. Thanks, Zach. Okay, that was cool. I had found other ones before. Or, I mean, multiple ones before, so I could put these away. So that answered a lot of questions, like what these were for. It, it always said, like, Ak could use them. But at the same time, I'm always like, what? What do I do? Because there was never ever anything to, like, give it to him. But... Now the next thing is, what are these for? An ancient draft manuscript of an adventurer named Marco. It seems like it's some kind of entertainment show that never got off the ground. So eventually will I have like a reason to like play these? Or a device? 
Because I've never ever seen anything to play those. Nonetheless, time for bed. Maybe. Yes, time for bed. Wait, I have to feed the animals. Eighteen of fifty. It's not playing right now. It's very calming. Twenty-two of thirty. I think the llamas eat like crazy. So. Oh, thirty of thirty. Never mind. They either eat, don't eat like crazy, or. Anyways. Um, my sister's husband is. Whoops, just went. Let me go to bed. Not read that. Be easier. Uh, my sister's husband is like the mountain man who used to be a lumberjack and now works in a machine shop and used to live in a house with no power. Ooh, no power or nothing in the woods. Oof. I, you know, applaud people who learned how to live like that though. Because, you know, I obviously grew up with like, you know, electricity and all that. But anytime I hear people who are kind of like, who grew up with no power or whatever just because I, I used to know someone who didn't have power or nothing like that he just lived in the woods and he loved it that was just his style I was like I applaud you because I couldn't do it I'm sorry I'm sorry I couldn't do it uh, I'm gonna remove my mask we've had it on for about half an hour so if you ever want to see anything like this like I have a cute little kitty mask on it kind of goes almost exactly with my ears there I have a whole bunch of props we could use and I will be adding more as I find them but that is something you can redeem in chat for 900 points there's also some other channel redemptions in there that are fun and also some are DVD so don't mind those but or don't mind those today I mean Um, uh, oh! Angel. Yes. Shall we hang out together tomorrow? Sure! Love to. Date with Gus at Peach Plaza tomorrow. Ooh, at night. Okay. Tomorrow night. Gotcha. Love you guys. Have a wonderful day at work. <laughs> oh, I was going to see what these fireflies were for. I have them in my hand still, but I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing anything. Uh, oh, here comes Ack! He's here to work! Let's go! I don't know what he's going to do. Oh, that might have been maybe why... Well, he's here to see what's her name, but it, that might have been why, like, the, the llamas were fed. He might have done it. Okay, uh, so today we gotta go to the... Oh, I need to do this. Um, oh, I don't need to do this anymore. I was gonna, I was making something. I don't want to make it anymore. I, I figured out what I wanted to do. Um, so what I need to do... I need to get worn fur and a lot of plant fibers. Because I need 10... I need 30. I got plenty of this. I need some mucus too, so... We need to beat up some things with mucus and fur I get from my animals. So that might not be a big deal. But they don't give it give me fur at the rate I need it. So I'm probably gonna have to go beat up something. Which fur was it, though? I wasn't paying attention. I just saw fur. Oh, look at my ducks! <laughs> oh my god, they're so cute! Oh, here, Pinky's coming to see, too. She's like, oh, we have ducks. That's nice. I mean, I saw what the chicks look like because uh, Emily has chicks. So, I mean, she might have had ducks somewhere, too, and I just don't remember, but... Look at all the ducks! They're so cute! Never will I sell these. These four are mine forever. Oh, find the warthog den! That's... Okay, it's over here. What's this? Lava grilled fish. What does that mean? 
Oh. What do you want? Ah, I was looking for you. I heard that you've just finished the lift to the Western Plateau. Good on ya. Yep. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it, Magic, if you want <laughs> to get it to me somehow. <laughs> my game needs lots. My game needs a lot, so I can take it from my game for sure. If it gets it off of you, I'm for it. Yeah, need anything? What? A guy can't congratulate someone on a job well done? He's got to want something in return, huh? I just wanted to tell you about something on the Western Plateau I think could be very uh, has a point. beneficial like for the both of us. Ever heard of Lava Rock? Yes, because I already hit it. You mean an igneous rock? Uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I was just gonna say, yeah, it's good technical here. If you've got igne, igne, uh, lava, uh, rock. lava rocks, I can make a special dish I heard about. A seaside delicacy called lava grilled fish. Where down the street is, you mix a couple lava rocks in with your charcoal and you can actually see the moisture from inside the fish being baked out. And the fish ends up tender yet delightfully chewy. There's nothing else like it. And I don't plan to stop with the fish. No, no, no. I can start cooking all kinds of things with them igna... ignoramus rocks. <laughs> so what do you say? Can you hook a Hulu brother up with a few lava rocks? Let's try something new. I got lots, actually. Right on. I think I'm already hearing that fish sizzle. Boy, you're in for a treat. Uh, oh, he's running off, though. I have, wait, what do, what do I actually have to do? What is the exact thing he wants me to do? 10 of them. I have 10 of them. I got this. I have no idea where I've got 120 of them. Hold up, Mr. You, I don't remember your name. Red? The Red Hulu brother? Oh, yeah, this is it. This is what I've been dreaming of. I'll round up all my brothers and grill up a bunch of fish for everybody. Ba -da -da -da! Let's go. Okay, um. I got off to what I was doing. <laughs> I need, I'm talking, yeah, actual mucus, yeah, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> my, my game, it, not to sound gross either, but my game also, it, the mucus they're talking about kind of looks like that. <laughs> it's gross, I don't know, but the game wants it, so. Can I yell at the killer that just killed me yet? Why, yeah, why, why do you want to yell at him? Okay, I, need, I was doing this, but I need to go. Oh, I remember what I was doing. Okay, um, let's go grab a llama. Let's go see what that warthog thing is. We, I, I don't know who we've haven't haven't taken out in a while, so I'm just gonna take Lloyd today. So I'm gonna go do this, and then on my way, if I see the things I need to hit, I will. I don't know which way I'm going, but that's okay. I'm going the wrong way. I need to go up by the tree farm. See, oh, see, she did have ducks, so I had seen them. I need hens next. Look at these eggs. This way? Ah, this way. So, we're back here. Oink, 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 oink. <laughs> okay. He's so cute. Oh my god, you're so adorable. You are like cute, cute, but cuter. No, I don't think she's cuter, but oh my god, he's cute. Okay, I need to go find Emily. Okay. Thank you. I don't know if you're the fur. I need. Ow! You're not dead. Sorry, I don't remember. I don't need those hats. Uh, I don't even know if you picked them up. I can't remember what fur I needed, though. Let's go back and look. And we'll see if we see Emily on the way. 
Oh, ew, camping was hitting on hook. Put me on hook and stood in front of me, hitting me until I died on hook. I freaking that oof. That rubs me the wrong way when they do that. That rubs me the wrong way when they do that. Killed Ducky, for, killed Ducky first and stood in front of him and hit him. Then after Ducky died, he got me, put me on hook, first hook, and st stood there and hit me until I died on hook. Can you zoom in with the me face? Because Ducky was wondering if you... Ha oh, had a nose. If I have a nose, you mean... Like this? I have a nose. Is that what you're talking about? <laughs> Oops. That sucks though. I hate it when killers do that. I was doing something I'm trying to remember. Uh, oh, I have to talk to Emily. Oh, I remember what I was doing. Okay. Never mind. I got sidetracked. It's okay. I need ward fur, not delicate. Okay, so I don't want to beat them up. I think that's the wrong bridge. I think um llamas. Oh my god, are we having like a father son moment over here? Oh. Oh, this is so cute. I think they're having a father son moment. I won't intrude. I'm sorry. You guys have fun. Ah, oh, wow. That is so cute. I can get it on hit. Um, okay, one more. Oops, I didn't want that guy. Stop! Shame. I need to go to the thing. Um, also chop down these trees. I got a lot to do. Oops, that's not the button I wanted. I got a lot to do. things you don't have a nose it's so hard to see I will agree it is very hard to see my character's nose because I don't have the greatest of uh, overlay for it but I do in fact have a nose it's just hard to see Dougie wants to know if you're having lava burgers for abusing <laughs> No, sadly, I am not having llama burgers for all the abuse that I give on the llamas. Oh, wait. I think I have to pay to get in here, right? I mean, I have to. That's exactly it, though, Magic. It's the lack of skill. Mm -hmm. I completely agree. I forgot exactly what I was here for, but was it aluminum ore? Nonetheless, I need crap, so. Ah, okay, got it. Gonna figure out how to get out of the, in, the screen.
I don't know really what you find in this, uh... Ruins that's different than the other two. Other than there's a couple extra... Resources, but other than that, I don't know exactly if there's anything like these things. That are different. Oh, and the killer was even ghost face? Ugh, that's even almost worse. Ghost face is hard to control, so maybe they just don't realize uh, the potential ghost face can have if you don't have to do that crap. Like, it just irritates me. Like, it, it irritates me when they hit you on hook, no matter what they're doing. Now, I can get it maybe if you've pissed them off because, you know, you ran them. I mean, in my opinion, you just get good. But at the same time, it's like, I feel like you've got bigger problems in your life if you are just going to hit me on hook for no good reason. Hitting me on hook is like an, in the end game chat saying something salty. Discovered a fish sub. Alright. See, I think I'll go through these for these three things and then we will head out of the mine and then see if we can find a couple more trees to cut down before we head home. Painting of a sea lion? Sounds cute. Sculpted lion piece. I should also. Ooh! Oh, wait! This is where you can find. I think they said the data chips. Oh, no, that's a small skill. Silicone chip. How do I get out of here? Oh, here we go. Cave entrance. So I can eat them on stream? I don't know about that. <laughs> I, I, I've thought about, though, buying things that are weird to eat on stream. But I'm also a chicken at the same time. Let's go get these trees. sell some wood and I just realized it. I think Ow! Excuse me! Oh, that's not doing anything. <laughs> Mr. Snake, stop! Cutting down a tree here and there's a snake hitting me in the process. Let's go see if I can uh, I don't know, this is open at a certain time. See if I can sell maybe something here. Don't mind me walking in with my chainsaw. It's all okay. It's all okay. Also, I could check here at the same time if it's weak is up yet. Nope. Wasn't it hardwood? I think it was hardwood. It said I could sell. Hope so. Uh, and then everything else, I'd have to come back and check. I don't remember if I have too much of all this stuff. I'm free! Let's go! It's the weekend! How do I get out of here? So that means it's 5 o'clock, right? Yup. So, Q 
curious. So is Ak doing this stuff? Cause I never see him doing it, but that doesn't mean anything. I might have to actually instruct him to. He doesn't have the home panel. I'll have to go back and look at it. Okay, let's let's see what we have here. Eight ironwood planks. Oh wait. Excuse me. Oh, I forgot my finger on the wrong button. Five <laughs> aluminum. Big summer blowout. Aluminum plates. Magic! Thank you so much for the five hundred biddies. That actually kind of scared me. <laughs> I don't know why, but it did. Thank you so much for the 500 biddies. And uh, happy weekend to you, Magic. It is now officially the weekend for you. Oops, I messed that up. I need five. I've made two. I need three more. I need nine more. Let's go. Okay. Uh, whoops. Wait. 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 Yes. I am so bad. I don't know why. The length I've played this game, I'm so bad at keeping my things filled for fuel. Okay. So that's being made. Oh wait, no, not wooden board. I've got enough mucus, I think, but I still need a lot more iron wood, so I'm gonna have to go back and get more of that. So these guys are all ha oh, this, these are ripe. Oh, let's go. These guys are all happy. Uh, oh, <laughs> no! My inventory's full! Does it? Oh, it does! It gets you your 10k bit badge. Oh my lord, magic. That is so crazy that you hit 10k. Thank you so much for all the amazing support. And I appreciate you so much. Did that? I don't know if magic's still here because I know she just got off work. But does that give you... I can't remember what I said it as. Does that give you the 10... Uh, the new emote? I can't remember. I think I put it at 10k. The new panda emote that's like a sus emote. I just can't remember where I put it. <laughs> no, I agree. No, Brad. No. No. Most of the stuff I needed, so that's okay. But again, Magic, thank you so much for everything. All your continued support and everything. You are just simply amazing. And I appreciate everything you do. What is this? Soil. So I'll put that there for now. Cultivated soil. That's not what I'm looking for. Uh, hold on to all this stuff because I can't remember why I needed it. <laughs> can't remember why I needed that, but I'm gonna hold on to it. Oh, there was something back there in that slot I could have used, but okay. Call me Big Daddy Jill. <laughs> all right, Big Daddy. <laughs> Yes! You did unlock the sus mode! Enjoy, enjoy. Pretend it never I thought that's where I put it, because I knew you were close when I had gotten that, and I was like, I gotta give Magic something for 10k, because I know she's very close, and I had an extra emote I wanted, so... That is for you all when you hit 10k bits. It is a cute little panda sus emote! And thank you, Brad, so much for giving Magic a shout-out. Because you're so amazing as for everyone showing all the more love than we can ever repay you with. 
so true, but I didn't even see the clip. I heard it, but I wasn't paying attention, but I agree. Magic is amazing. She is so supportive, and there's just like sometimes not even words I could even say for all the support and love she gives us all. A bad with words anyways, but definitely bad when it comes to trying to even tell you all the amazing stuff she is. Oh, I'm in the wrong one, sorry. I'm yelling for no reason, sorry. This is the one I wanted. Oh no, I have to open it. Um, I will plant those. I have not been paying attention to the calendar. And I say that because I'm sure I've missed something, like somebody's birthday was coming up. And I might have missed it. Oh, mm. Mm, where'd I put my mucus? <laughs> Not a sentence I thought I'd ever say. There's my soil I was looking for, though. Ah, found it. Where, what is this? Aluminum ore. Eh? No? Eh? Oh, okay, it goes in there. I'm almost done! I'm almost done! This takes me, I don't know why this takes me so long to put all this stuff in my inventory, but it does. Okay, I think that's all. I think everything else can stay in my hands and where I need to sell and where I need to give away or all that good stuff or I need to open it up. Yes, so now, oh, I had pumpkins in my hand. No, I didn't. Lies, I did not have pumpkins in my hands. Just like the support where I, when I can, well, I appreciate it nonetheless. I think you're amazing, so. I do love to support you as much as I can as well. I think you have magic. I think you have. You have been absolutely amazing to me and open and everything ever since I met you. And I could not ask for anyone better to have met on Twitch. For the first, not for the first time, but from one of the earliest people I ever met on Twitch. Twitch who really helped me keep going with streaming. I think you were one of the first people who ever really rated me and made me feel like I could really do what I was doing. Because you still supported me no matter what. And I remember, I still have it. I still have the message you sent me. You had no idea who I was. But you still sent me a message that said you hoped that I would get to affiliate and all that. And I appreciated that so much. I really made me feel so good. Way back when I wasn't even an affiliate yet. I have pumpkins. What, 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 what? Didn't I put my pumpkins away? Oh, that's a giant pumpkin. Okay, I'm out of food inventory. What are these? Apples. Roma apples. I'll hold those. Okay. I'm having inventory issues. It's okay. I think I'm done. Plants. Plants. Uh. Fertilize. I actually don't know if I have to do that because Axe is supposed to be doing that, but. I'm going to bed, nonetheless. <laughs> I'm going to bed. Oh, I'm so happy to see your face too, Gus. Gonna put this here so I can kind of pause my game for just one second. Stop, I'm crying. I'm sorry, Magic, I didn't mean to make you cry. <laughs> but I do mean everything. I do mean it all. I just want the best for everyone, and same. I just want the best for everyone as well, including you. 
And you know I try to support you just as much because you know I love you. You know I do. It's been, it's been, I've been on this stupid site for 10 years and it's been rare to, that I find a place that keeps and makes me feel like family. Same, not the 10 years, but finding those communities that accept you into their community and actually make you feel like you are part of their family, community, whatever the case may be. I like to say it's like an online family because it really is. And I'm the same. I don't have a lot of people on offline that I can talk to, like to talk to, or even really care about that much. But some of the people I found online have been way better friends than most of the people I have come across in my real life. So. I want everyone happy and want everyone to know that someone out there cares for them. Exactly. Same, 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 100%. I mean, I've played Sims, right? Right? But I am the same way. Like, I, I want my chat, my community, my Discord, you know, wherever we all may be, to know that we all do care. We all do care about you. We're not here to just be like, hi, thanks for coming into my chat, subbing, that's about all I care about. You know, no, no, no. I want you to know I care about you as a person. And every gust, watch out, I'm carrying poop. And I, and I, you know, maybe I can't support in some ways, but I try and support in the ways that I can so that they know that I am there. I do care about you and everything. Chasing the light is about to expire. What the hell? Oh, I'm supposed to show Emily something. Oh my God, I got onto a tirade about other things. Angel. I was talking to Pinky, but it's okay. Angel, I go to Atara for work sometimes. You take care of yourself at home. I know I do a lot of stupid things and say a lot of stupid things, but I try my best to be a nice person. I am human, sometimes fail because nobody is perfect, but I try. I know the feeling, yes. I know, I am the same way. And I will say stupid stuff even on stream. And it may even come out the wrong way, but it's 100% okay. We're all human. We all make mistakes. We all have problems. We all have our own life offline, things that are bothering us and everything. But it, you know, at the end of the day, it's so true. We are all human. It happens, but we always try our best. And that's all that anyone ever can expect from anybody, honestly, because you know, like I said, people have things offline going on. That we may not talk about that is bothering us and that might you know come out in a, in a anywhere in a chat or wherever we may be it might come out wrong because you know we are frustrated with something else but at the end of the day i still love you and i know life can be hard it can be believe me i've been through shit in my life and it's been rough at times and i have probably sometimes let it out on stream or maybe in a chat at somebody but I try my best to make sure you all know that you are amazing, you're, you're human, it happens, and I love you nonetheless. Just say hi or lurking is more than enough, yes. Like, I, I'm a big lurker, so I, you know, I always feel bad that I don't say hi, but at the same time, I know a lot of you who know me know that I'm there and know that I'm still supporting you, even if I maybe I'm having a day where I just don't really feel like saying hi or I don't feel like talking, or whatever the case may be. But I try to always pop in and say hi, just to say hi, because I always do like to see how you're doing, how's everything going, stream going okay, if you're playing Dead by Daylight, is the fog treating you fine, you know, and all that stuff. See, that's super sweet. That is super sweet. And that's what I like, like about my community, I like making sure everybody feels accepted no matter what making sure they always know we care my dms are always open if uh, especially more discord i think my twitter ones are open too but if you aren't on either discord or twitter i don't know if twitch even just how those messages are working anymore but anyway my messages are always open especially on discord i check that the most and i also check uh twitter the most sip sip oh thank you blossom i would have missed that thank you so much for the sip sip I need it. I need it. Oh, my water is getting warm. Blech. I forgot to put ice in it, but it's okay. Lukewarm water works. Listen, I love you all. I love you too, Magic. 
and Brad and Blossom and anyone else who is in chat who is lurking. You know I love you. If you're lurking, it's totally fine. Lurking is perfectly fine. It is... What did... What, hi, I forgot what they called it. Lurking is like the backbone of Streetbeak because, you know, not everybody wants to talk. Not everybody enjoys chatting. And you are loved just the same. Lurker. Someone who's been subbed for five years. Someone who just chats. It don't matter. You're loved the exact same way. She, listen, she answers that it's rare, but she does. Who? Me or magic? I mean, I, I know I sometimes don't always answer my messages. <laughs> I think that's what we're saying. But I always look at them. I do always look at them. Unless I'm having my mental day... I call it my mental health day, where I do, I don't get on my Discord because I just want to take a day to myself and just kind of, you know, spend a day in my room or, you know, around my house, depending on what I'm doing, and just kind of, you know, zen out. That's kind of what I do. I just kind of zone out and I do my thing. But I will always read my messages on Discord and they're always open, so you can always message me. It might take me a day to get back to you, but I promise I will listen and I'll be there. Cool, you are also close together. We, you know, Blossom, you are too. You know I love you. <gasps> Maria, I love that emote. That's still my favorite. And that is too, if you like, if you don't want to chat, just put it in the cuddle emote. And I know you sitting back chilling and lurking. You don't have to do it though. If you just want to lurk without anything, it's fine. But <laughs> The little cuddle emote, I always know. If you push that in chat, I always know. You're you're chilling, and I appreciate it. <laughs> Brad, you're on my favorite turns. I wouldn't shit you. <laughs> Freaking love it, yes. Okay, after drive. All right, Magic, safe drives home. If you don't make it back in this stream, I will see you in your stream a little bit later on. I promise I will be there. But if I don't, if you don't make it back here, have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you just a little bit and safe drives home. Oh, no, I know you were. I know you were. I was just reiterating that, yes, there might be a day, like, if you do message me, it may take me, like, a day to get back to you. Like, I'm not ignoring you. Never, ever, 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 ever think I'm ignoring you because I'm not. There are just days that I will not get online at all. So... It's one of my faves. It's one of my faves. Do I freaking love it? Cookies did an absolute amazing job. Not only on that one, but all of them. I love them all. She did amazing. I magic just unlocked the. This, I think I call it Sassimote. That is for 10k bits. But I still am shocked that she's at. That's so amazing. And because it was one of my favorites, I actually put it as my Discord. Uh, my Discord. Uh, picture. Not my picture, but it, the Discord server picture. Which, by the way, is open. If anyone in chat wants to join the Discord, it is now open for all to enjoy. I have no idea if I've talked to him, so I'm just gonna give him a kiss goodbye. <laughs> we got on a little little talk there, which I love doing every once in a while. I, I kissed Gus and I'm just like, FERTILIZER! And QQ's shown us his bullet. Hey, Gus just gave me $952. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> Love you even more that you gave me some money. Uh, could be as bad as I sent a message and didn't get a response for three months. <laughs> you know, I hope to never do that again. But <laughs> it could. No, I really hope that it, I can. What, with what I am doing, like I was saying earlier with my taking that one mental health day. Hoping that eliminates that ever happening. Just saying. <laughs> Plasmid, hello! How's it going? Welcome on in, Raiders! Oh my gosh, I heard this clip and I got so confused there for a second. I could not figure out why I heard Dead by Daylight. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. <laughs> Let me pause my game. Plasma, thank you so much for the raid and bringing your community in. And thank you, Brad, for the shout out for Plasma. And how was stream? How was Dead by Daylight today? It doesn't matter if 
if it does take that long, we are for life. And you know that. And I appreciate that so much. I appreciate that so much. I have mental health problems, so sometimes I feel bad about it. But knowing you guys are always there for support, it means absolutely the world to me. And like Brad and Magic, they've seen me go through times where I've had to take months off, but they always come back. Well, Maria too. Maria's been here quite a while as well. We'll put Maria there. And a lot of you guys have been. And I appreciate you all always coming back. I, it, I, there's no words to explain how thankful I am for that. Hello, how are you? How was stream? Mental days are such a necessity once in a while just to reset, yes. And that's what I'm trying to do is that I'm trying to take that one day, maybe two, just kind of depends on, you know, what's been going on, you know, to just be offline, you know, go outside, do something or do something even around my house or like magic was getting back into writing and I would like to get back into writing and just take that one day to the to reset and that was yesterday for me because one I had no power in the afternoon so I mean I couldn't be online <laughs> so I just said screw it I'm just gonna take the rest of the day off and continue this mental health day and then I woke up the next morning just like ooh, I'm so refreshed I feel so good about everything and it's definitely needed change my names to Bradsby Nah, you're just sweet, Brad. Nah, don't do that. I kind of regret playing DVD today after being, oh, being off for a month. Triggered my anxiety. Ooh, and migraines, and now I'm down because of it. Oh, no, I'm so sorry. That's never good. DVD can be rough. I, I know. Believe me, I don't take time off DVD very often. I only stream it the two days. Well, I take it off on the weekends, I guess I could say, but I, I don't take off normally the days I stream it. And there has been some days where... I regret playing because it was a bad day and then I would get off stream and I would just be in a sour mood because my anxiety was high and everything and it's just like I should have just gotten off way sooner I mean Brad can tell you there's been times where he's had to call me down in chat because I'm just like all upset because the game is pissing me off and causing me to get all anxious and everything so I know the feeling hopefully everything's okay now that you're offline or well he's off DB Hopefully everything calms down and you're good. I do have a raid video to show you. I have a raid video for you. Let me introduce myself because I forgot to do that. Hello, everybody. Welcome on in Raiders. My name is Scarlet. I'm a Dead by Daylight streamer on Mondays and Wednesdays. However, today is Friday. So we do variety on Friday, which can be anything from a really spoopy game to something cutesy. Kind of like Portia right now is cutesy. Um, and I am also, I can't say this much longer, but I am a new-ish VTuber. I started doing VTuber, VTubering. Yeah, VTubing. That's sure. That will go with that. Uh, earlier this year to help with, as we were talking about, mental health issues, because being on camera makes me a little uncomfortable and everything. This way I can kind of just chill, do my own thing. Uh, so the clips you're going to see are older. One thing I'm going to try and work on this weekend is maybe a new video again. But I gotta compile clips to see if I've got enough. And, uh, but this will show you what I used to do as a variety streamer as well as not a VTuber and stuff like that. I, yeah, I usually just stop playing when that happens now. I need to learn that so bad. I do, because what happens is I don't stop playing. And then it gets worse. And then I regret it. But I need to learn that. I'm trying to learn that. Some lady, maybe. Uh, some lady mad she lost came on my stream and insulted me by telling me I look like a clown. Yeah Yeah, people will be like that and um, You know what I say to them fan. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Get out of my stream. I Hate when people get all salty over a video game. Uh, like I said, I'll admit I Might say something in stream because I'm frustrated, but at the end of the day I calm down. And I'm like it's a Video game. It's fine all good it used to get to me so badly but now I just turned it off that's all that is exactly what you need to do you need to just if, if you're starting to feel it coming on turn the game off go do something else go hang out with friends go play a different game do whatever but I need to learn that because there's been a couple of streams where I didn't because I felt like I had to keep going because that was just what we were doing that day on stream and I needed to not. And there has been people who come into my chat and just been complete assholes. And I'm just like, 
I ignore them or I will say my piece and then mods ban them and then I move on. I hate sore losers. Yeah, right. Or sore winners <laughs> when I play killer. <laughs> exactly. I know that feeling. Yes, those sore winners as well. Yeah. I, I, I've had some sore winners come in, not into my chat, but into end game chat. I'm just like, sip my tea, go on my day, thanks a lot. Congratulations, whatever. I mean, I run my mouth, but it's like, was just rude and uncalled for. And then, of course, she ran before she could get a. a yeah, that's, they will do that sometimes. And I, I will admit, I run my mouth sometimes too. It's. I hate to say it, but it's like kind of part of video gaming. But at the same time, it's like, I don't normally mean the things I say. It's the heat of the moment in a very intense game. But also, after the game is over, going into somebody's chat who is live to say something just mean or stupid or whatever the hell is just uncalled for. I don't even say anything mean in in-game chats half the time because I'm just like, whatever, move on. But believe me, there's been many times I've wanted to just like let loose in in end game chat at somebody. And I have kind of let loose on my stream at somebody before for coming to my chat being an asshole, but they deserved it. I'm like, GG, uh, yeah, I'm like, GG, you won. Now no need to insult my killer skills. I know I'm bad. Exactly. That was a pinhead game for me. That was a pinhead game for me. They just insulted me. They're like, get good. I was like, I had won a bad game for sure. But yes, I'm bad. Leave me alone. <laughs> At least I'm trying. I always feel like people who say that when they insult your your gameplay um, as killer, I feel like they don't know how hard it is to be killer sometimes. They might be survivor mains and they've never actually tried killer. Not saying that's always the case, but I kind of feel that's the case. This killer's hard. Stressful. It's all those things. All right, I'm gonna play my raid video for you guys real quick. Uh, and again, thank you so much, Blasphemous, for the raid and trusting you with. I was gonna say that backwards. Excuse me. Trusting me with your community. I appreciate that. And now sit back and enjoy the raid video. Oh, my eyes disappeared. Oh, no. Oh. I'm like, I broke Kermit. <laughs> He's funny. <laughs> I like Kermit. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> 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 he scared the crap out of me. <laughs> I need to put windows still, so um, I'm not gonna put this. <gasps> no! Oh no! No! <laughs> no! Oh, I've got a floating. Smoke detector! <laughs> oh, I was doing so good and this kitchen has been the worst. There's no- oh, oh, oh my god! Huh? <laughs> Why did you yell at everything? I turned around and there was a- Oh my god, it scared the hell out of me! Desert! Oh, I <laughs> But the, oh, the penguin went in my house! Look at him! He's just passing through, I think. Look at him! Oh, he's so adorable! I forgot there's penguins in this game. Ah, oh, this is a crow door. Okay. Oh, Jesus! Oh my god, she scared the hell out of me. No wonder she wasn't in there. him oh because I wasn't letting it hit the ground where'd he go <gasps> there's me everywhere I need a burrito no oh no I lost her this <laughs> <me>. <laughs> oh no I can't! 
chat right now and thank you for making city i do that every time sally dance i'm always trying to say kitty and sally at the same time for making her dance as well as feeding her your reactions are the best <laughs> well thank you maria that's one thing i miss about cam is you guys can't see like my genuine like facial reaction to some of the things because you know you can hear it in my voice maybe but you can't see my genuine reaction sometimes that you know mental health comes first so um so but i read this but i'm gonna read it again but also you don't know what triggers other people or what they're going through i struggle with my weight and such and like that comment just triggered me and then my husband is upset this random hoe came and upset me to the point i felt it the best to end stream some people are just stupid like what did you gain you still lost i still won and you look like a total bitch talking shit in my stream jokes on her because i'll do it again tomorrow exactly they we were talking kind of about this uh not too long after you, before you came in or it might have been earlier in the stream but we were talking about how people don't realize what others are going through off stream you know we might say stupid shit sometimes to either somebody we even care about and definitely sometimes obviously with randos coming in our stream but sometimes it's because people don't realize what we are going through off stream. We don't share every little detail about our lives, obviously. And when somebody says something really mean like that, sometimes it could trigger something extremely bad to, to you know, whoever you're talking to. And I've never been... I can't say I've never really been insulted to the point where I've ended stream, but I have ended stream before from feeling overwhelmed. And so, cause I, I could, I don't want to go into like detail about it. It was a long time ago. It was like way back before I had a face cam or anything. Something was said, the way it came off to me was so rude. I got so upset to the point I wanted to cry. I ended the stream. I ended the stream. I deleted the VOD and I never went back to it. Um, but I honestly was having a bad day too. And that person didn't realize what they said really triggered something in me. And it really caused me to get very, very, very upset that day. But like you said, at the end of the day, you know, they were still a bitch. And we know that that person who insulted us like that means absolutely nothing. If they are gonna come into a stream and say something like that. We just have to remember that person isn't meant for our community. That person isn't meant to be in our chat. Ban them, get rid of them, and understand that there are people who do care about you and won't say stupid shit like that. It's, I know, it's so funny, but I understand not wanting to be on camp. Yeah, and I, 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 I hate, like, we played the Mortuary Assistant. And I was so kind of sad that I didn't have a cam so you guys could literally see how terrified I was. But then at the end of the day, I have to remember, it is still, I still need, you know, mental health number one. I will preach it. Mental health number one, and I have to take care of myself. So it sucks, but at the same time, too bad. <laughs> Right? <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> Magic, thank you so much for the hugs and Brad for the hugs for both of me and Magic. I appreciate that. Don't let idiots ruin your day. You're amazing and wonderful. Exactly. And it'll get to us. It it just happens. You know, I've had people say things in in-game chats that I'm just like, I don't, you know, I couldn't even tell you, like, I just wanted to, like, quit the game for the day. And sometimes I do have to because I'm like, fine. If I'm so bad, I'll quit for the day. Go play something else, and I'll be fine later. But if it comes into my chat, I just tell my mods, freaking ban them. If I don't see what happened, I don't even care. 
ban them, get rid of them. They're not right for our community because if the first thing you're gonna come into my chat and say is something rude, I don't want you around. I don't want you around. I'm scared to death to get on cam. It's why you look at nothing on the screen and that's fine. That's totally fine. If you don't want a cam, if you're comfortable with no cam, that is 100% fine. Nobody, there is no rule to streaming that says you have to have a cam, you have to not have a cam, you, or you know, whatever, can't have a cam, have to be a VTuber, whatever. You stream the way you want to stream. No cam, perfect. Camera, perfect. VTuber, perfect. You do you. You make sure you're comfortable in your stream. That is all that matters. Be comfortable in your own stream. And if that's camera, no camera, banning some asshole, doing whatever it takes to make sure you're comfortable and as well as your community. That is definitely obviously a big thing too. Make sure your community is safe as well. Because I, yes, I'm the streamer, but I also wanna make sure you guys are all okay. You guys are comfortable. If there's an asshole in my chat bothering you, I will ban them for you because obviously if you're not a mod, you can't ban them. I will ban someone if they come in my chat and they're insulting you. No, I will ban them in my chat. That is just no, no negativity in my chat whatsoever. And I've also told, I forgot to tell this to Magic off stream because I'm bad and I have horrible memory, but if my mods ever see somebody who's been in my chat who goes to somebody else's chat and bees an asshole. Bees an asshole? Yeah, I can't talk. But is an asshole in somebody else's chat, they will be banned in my chat if I see that. Because I don't want your negativity in somebody else's chat leaking into my community. So just saying, you go over to Magic Chat and you be an asshole over there, I will ban you on my channel as well. Just saying. We are all one big community. It needs to be done. I will ban you there. I will ban you in Blossoms. I will ban you in Brad's. Don't. <laughs> I know if I got on camera, I'd get fat comments a lot, a ton, so I couldn't. Like I said, people, yes, people are going to say that. People have told me when I had a camera that I was ugly. Don't really give a crap. And, but at the same time, yes, mental health, it will bother me in the end. So that's why I'm a VTuber. It's also just more comfortable. It's a lot more comfortable for me. But if you don't have a camera because of that reason, that's perfectly fine. It's you come first. You need to make sure you're safe for your mental health as well as, well as comfortable. Exactly, right? Why be salty when you can be sweet like ice cream? I totally 100% agree. At the end of the day, it's also just a video game. It's just a video game. Just say it. <laughs> Brad's over here all gonna be insulting everybody now and then <laughs> going to other people's streams. <laughs> I know it. Brad gonna be over here. He gonna be insulting people. <laughs> Widespread, whoops. Widespread hate when you can spread love. I always try to uplift, even though I'm a bit of an asshole. I'm too sarcastic, but some people are just like that. A bitter, and well, sorry, I totally. Yeah, words and me don't get along. I'm sorry, I screwed up that sentence. Let me try that again. But still, some people are just like that. Bitter over a game. Yes, people are. I don't get why. Some people are way too bitter in games. And it's like, you know what? You got bigger things. If you got, if you gotta be bitter in a game, you got bigger issues. Cause I get off stream after games and I'm just like, I don't hold no grudges in a game. I ain't gonna be salty in no game. I ain't gonna let that seep into my life. That's kind of how I feel, but I'm the same. I want to make sure, I want to spread all the positivity because the world in general is just full of so much negativity and stuff that I don't want it on my stream. That's why I don't talk about controversial topics on my stream, even though maybe sometimes they need to be talked about, but at the same time, I don't, want it on my stream because I want this to be a place where you guys all come to get away from something for just even three hours or however long I'm on. I know there's topics out there that need to be talked about, but also I don't want it on my stream because I also just want this to be a place where we can hang out and just kind of relax and just forget about 
everything that is going on in the world or whatever, maybe even your life. Maybe something's going on in your life and this topic is bothering you and I don't want you coming in here and getting all upset because we're talking about that topic. You know what I mean? I want everything to be like chill here as much as we can. Yes, we play Dead by Daylight, so it's not always chill, but you know, you give or take what you can. <laughs> it happens. Honestly, don't think you get those comments, Brad. I don't think so either, but I understand the the hesitance toward it. I do. <laughs> you're you're kind of right though, Brad. I, I read the next thing you said. Sip, sip. Oh, I took a sip, sip. Sorry. Thank I uh, thank you for the sip, sip. I took it and didn't even say it. Sip, sip. I need to move my sip, sip thing because it's not quite in my mouth. Thank you so much, Plasmid, for that. Uh, I was afraid I say, oh, Scarlet gets those comments, and she's a VTuber, so who knows, maybe I would or wouldn't, I don't know. Yeah, it just depends on what mean person you get in your chat. Some people are just meant to say something nasty in chat, then again, yeah, it, you never know. That's kind of the horrible thing about sometimes streaming is, you know, there may be a day where you get 10 toxic people flying into your chat saying stupid stuff then there's days where nothing bad happens and everybody is so amazing that happens more than none though people are always amazing we have not had a lot of days where a lot of toxic people have come in so you can tell me all day by the next match you're the first thought from my mind exactly you just move on next game i mean i've been telling a lot of games i'll be mad until my next game starts and then i'm like whatever new game Came through Thirsty Sips and thank you. I understand too, as of all, oh, as a fat woman, I get my share of discrimination every day. And I'm the same, like, I'm a bit bigger as well. So I know, I, you know, in real life, I've been called fat. And I've also, I mean, I've had people ask me if I was pregnant before, and I'm like, no, I'm just fat. Thanks. I'm just fat. So I get it. I, I absolutely 100% get it. I was gonna say something else and I don't know how to word it to make it sound like I'm not being rude to myself. But that's the main point is I don't use a camera because I don't want that. I don't, I don't want to hear it. I mean, yes, I know it's not true or yes, I know it's whatever. But at the same time, as a VTuber, I still get it even as a VTuber, but it just kind of takes that little bit of pressure off knowing that they can't actually see what a mess you look like today. Like, half the time when I'm streaming, I look like an absolute mess. But I'm a VTuber, so it don't matter. <laughs> I don't have to worry that my hair looks like it got run over by a bus or something. No, that's not how you would say that. But that my hair looks like a complete mess because I didn't feel like doing a style for the day or whatever. So, you know what? VTuber. It's nice. But if you don't want to be a VTuber, that's fine too. It's all good. It don't matter. But I totally, I actually, I, I get it. I get it. Oh, Brad! Maria, I have seen the pictures. You are beautiful. Pam, I, you are not fat. You are perfect 100%. I think I'm the good size for myself. I'm not skinny. I'll just say that. I'm bigger. But I don't care. I am the size and I'm happy with it. I could lose weight. Sure. Do I want to? Not really. I like eating my hot dogs and stuff in my face with hamburgers and cookies after, you know. I'm good. I could definitely be smaller, but I don't want to be at the same time. But yeah, I've been called pregnant before because um, I'm a little bit bigger. And uh, the one time that happened, not the one time, the one of the instances that happened was this guy was with his like, girlfriend, wife or whatever, because they used to work in retail. He said something and... I said, no, I'm not pregnant. And his girlfriend looks at him, she's like, she hits him, she goes, that's why you don't say things like that, or something like that. <laughs> and I'm like laughing my head off because this poor guy just got smacked by his girl for calling me pregnant. And she, you know, she looked at me, she goes, I'm sorry, I've told him not to comment on these things. And I'm like, it's fine, it's whatever, but thank you for smacking him because that made my day. <laughs> Being 
Being bigger isn't a bad thing. No, if you feel good the way you are, where's the problem? Exactly. Yes. I, like I said, I, there were times a long time ago I wish that I was smaller. Now, I don't give a shit. I'm fine with my size. I'm good. Like I said, I eat a hamburger and eat a ton of cookies after. Don't care. I'm happy the way I am. It's good. If you don't like it, move along is kind of what I say to him. Hell no, because I would break a twig. What? Oh, I see what you're saying. The Titans make me sad. I agree. They make me sad too, actually. I, instead of going on diets, sometimes what I would do was I would cut out one certain thing. And that would help. And I wouldn't miss that one thing. You know what? I tried a different bunch of different things, so. But I wouldn't miss that one thing after a while. Then I could still eat the way I wanted. That worked for me a couple times. But I stopped doing that because I didn't care anymore. I'm just like, whatever. I'm eating what I want. Life sucks. <laughs> you know? You go through those phases where life sucks. I'm eating whatever I want. I don't care what I look like. Yeah, I went through a phase like that a couple years ago. And now I'm just like, I just do whatever. I just do whatever I want, so. But I agree, diets make me sad. I don't know what I'm doing in this game right now. We're gonna play one more day and then we're gonna end, end stream. I got off on talking a bunch there, but I like talking to you guys. I feel like being an open community like this is amazing because there's been days where we would sit and talk about, there's an egg. I got an egg, let's go. <laughs> But there'll be days where we sit and talk for a bit and it's absolutely by the end of stream like when i get off stream i just feel so much better like we talked about it it's all you know out there and we all understand each other and we all showed each other the love and everything and i love it exactly exactly right Oop. diets don't make me sad it's that lying ass scale. <laughs> we have the in the closet that some of a bitch lies to me all the time. I know. I I I will be actually honest with you. Uh, no, I didn't want to add. Oh, I didn't do anything. Uh, I used to never own a scale. We do now because my mom wanted one, and I would just looked at her and like, why? Those things are evil. But uh, I used to never own one because I didn't want to know. I did not. Oh, I gotta go talk to Emily before anything. Um, I have a date with Gus as well. Oh no. But yeah, I didn't want to know. I was just like, you know what? I ain't buying a scale. I need your help again. Uh, there's a doorway in the ruins atop of the Western Plateau that is that I just can't open. I think there's a couple of broken motors involved. Could you please bring me a couple? Please bring some healing items and weapons as well as the ruins is crawling with danger. That'll be for next time we stream, for sure. Cause I ain't doing, though that might be one of those progressing things that takes forever. Where's Emily? Emily. Why am I running? I don't know. I could have brought a llama, but it's okay. Girl needs her exercise. Oh, true, true. If you need it for like a purpose like that, then yeah, I get it. it Where is she? So she's right here. Is she like in here? Let's go look. I don't know where she is. Hey, quiet already. Oh. Too quick yelling at each other. This isn't what I wanted. I thought this was Emily. Hopefully this isn't something I didn't want to do. <laughs> it's just a number two, exactly. Exactly, it's like age. It's just a number. Unless, for some reason you have to be at a certain number, I see, but at the same time, I'm just like, whatever, it's a number. I refuse to own a scale to my doctor's dismay. She plays this game diet or depression, despite the fact I don't like it. She's trying to make me get a scale to know when I've unhealthily lost some weight. Kind of sounds like a rude doctor, but I kind of see her point of view at the same time. But still rude. To say, I guess to say it like that. 
But I kind of get like, I kind of get like I, what she's trying to say at the same time, but I think that was probably probably a nicer way than saying it like that. <laughs> Just saying. Like, I get it. I mean, she's trying to look out for your health, but at the same time, no. No, not that. Please don't say it like that. With the health scare the other day, it's more than just getting down and looking smugly, right? No, yeah, I know. Like, some people obviously need to be... A... I hate to say it because it sounds so rude, but you guys know what I mean. Like, you do need to lose weight for health reasons as well. But obviously, don't overdo it at the same time. Like, make sure if you do need to, for whatever reason it may be, don't take it overboard. Just say it. I guess that's a good way to say it without making it sound completely rude. Because I'm not trying to make it sound rude. I'm not. I'm not like that. But at the same time, just if you have to, for health reasons, do it he healthily. Healthy. In a healthy way. Erla, what's bothering you? Oh, it's you. Can't you hear Carol and Mars are arguing about who should go for grocery shopping? I need to get a lot of printing done today, and I can't focus with them bickering all day. Did you not hear them? You know, my mom always said I had superhuman hearing. Speaking of which, someone's making a racket just outside the building. This isn't what I wanted to do. Tell them to pipe down for me. Sure. On it, I was looking for Emily. Apparently, I'm stuck doing something else. That's no, fine. Nice to see you here. I wish under Ma'am, what's wrong with your voice? I almost slipped on one of Scrap's presents. Ooh, wow, the quality of that voiceover was not good. <laughs> no, I'm not no, no man kitty. <laughs> oh my god, my brain! <laughs> by the way, you ain't ever seeing me in no swimsuit, by the way. I don't do swimsuits. <laughs> Last time I did was just because my friends took us to a spot I had to. Uh, yeah, I don't... Mm, you might not want to Google it, baby. I don't know what kind of pictures might show up. I don't even know how to explain it to make it sound... Uh, uh... Oh my god, it's very Google it! <laughs> Like I said, you might actually get some good pictures. I'm just saying, I wouldn't say that. But then again, I don't know what Google's gonna give you. <laughs> the Borat swimsuit. Oh no, not Borat swimsuit. That's actually a good explanation of it, though. But oh my lord. Like I said, depending on who it is, it might not fall off. But at the same time, I don't know what Google's gonna give out. Irma heard me all the way out here. Next time I slip and fall, I'll try to keep it to myself. Hmm. I love Irwa and everything, but that super hearing of his always has me walking on eggshells, <laughs> so to speak. I feel so bad I wasn't listening. Does that mean I have to pick up this poo? I don't know what the point to that was. I was just trying to find Emily. And I... I, I have no idea where she is. Um... Ah, she's up. Why is she at church? Is it Sunday? Oh, it's Sunday. She's at church. Borat is pretty much the only thing I see. I actually forgot all about Borat. I probably would have, if I would remember that, would have thought he would have been probably the thing that popped up for um, that Google. All right, let's run up to church here because that's is what Emily is. I'm gonna just stir her in church and be like, yo, Emily, I don't know why I'm here. I forget what we're talking about, but I'm gonna disturb her in church. May I sit? So when you left oh. the fireflies, he gave a happy oink? Yes! <laughs> That's great for him. Great for my plants as well. I wonder if now that we can go back into that little section that that warthog was in, I'm gonna call him Pumbaa, uh, and actually see him. Thank you for all the help. I've got more chores. I'll see you later, neighbor. See you later, see neighbor. All right. 
I wasn't really paying attention that I actually had that in a certain time frame. Oh, return to Uwa. Darn it. I got so much to do and I'm just like not paying attention. It's fine. <laughs> I'd say if Maria will take the picture, Maria probably will be like, no, nah, I'm good. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna just wander around for this day, do a few little things here and there, and then get to these things next time. Because I've lost all focus now, which is fine because it's almost time to get off, but I've lost all my focus for what I was doing. I'm just gonna do this one thing with Urwa and then probably like try and get some fur and stuff. And then next time we come back to stream on a variety Friday, we'll probably stick to Portia for a while. Because I'm off next Friday because that's Mama's appointment next Friday, so we won't have it then. Then the next Variety Friday is when we will probably play Porsche again. That was May out there? Oh, she slipped on. Oh, I see. Well, I'm glad she's all right, but she's right all there. this. We're just treating the symptoms rather than the actual problem. Lose my super hearing. Hmm. Oh! You can make those, right? If I just had earmuffs, I could turn my power on and off at will. You gotta help me. Sure. This is turning into like a little. You're the best. Soon I'm gonna be living the quiet life. This is turning into like a little um. What do you call it? Mission. So I have to go make earmuffs. Oh, he gave me a recipe, I think. I don't know. All right, let's go see what it takes to make earmuffs. Um, I like how that piece of poo is just permanently in the street now. I don't know why I didn't bring a llama. Well, actually, I know why. I just kind of got lost. <laughs> I just started wandering around in this game and forgot what I was doing. So, I really don't know what Ak is doing. I thought, I kind of thought he was supposed to be doing all this stuff, but he's not. But at the same time, I don't care. It's fine. I, I like doing all this stuff. Um, so what do I need for earmuffs? Is it at the bottom? Yes. Leather! Oh, okay. Can I make leather? Or is leather something I have to... Leather! Oh, no. Fur. It's fine. How long? Five hours? That would probably be right by the time stream ends. Uh, let's see. What can I do that's just, like, kind of chill for the next couple minutes before I have to go to sleep in the game. Oh, I'm gonna go look at this. I, I wanna see what this is in here about Ak, because supposedly he's supposed to be helping me. But he ain't never around, so... I wonder if I just stopped. Like, if I just stopped doing things around my house, like, if I stopped making things and everything, would he do these? Because I guess you could check these to stop ho ho harvesting. Harvesting crops, stop gathering animal stuff, workshop, blah, 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 all this stuff. Because my thing currently just says he helped add 20 lettuces to the stable, which means he added lettuce to my stable. That's why it was full. But he hasn't done anything else, but I am kind of proactive, and I did just kind of naturally do it. Maria can go skydiving with you because I said hell no. Yes, Maria can go with you if she wants. Because <laughs> Scarlet still says hell no. Alright, um... Oops. 
I gotta go back and look really quick. What was it that I needed for those waterproof things? Cause I, I need to do that probably, f not first thing when we come back, but almost first thing when we come back. Two, four, so I need six for that. None for this, that's fine. Worn fur, okay, it was worn fur I need. So I hate to do it, but I'm gonna go beat up some llamas and see if they give worn fur. Applicated, I know they give colorful fur. They do. Next time we come back to Portia, I need to go over there and see if that daily thing is done. But I'm not going to do it this time because I don't have much time in my day anyway. I hate it! Oh no, I have a date to go on! I totally forgot! Uh oh. Ah, I forgot. Gus wanted to go on a date and I totally just. Ignored that. Um, where was it? I think it was Peach Plaza. Let me go grab a llama. All right, we got on Lloyd, so we're gonna go to Peach Plaza here. Yes. Oh, darling. Let's go. Let's go. I want to see what you have planned for me. <laughs> I honestly, Brad, I did not realize I wasn't following you. The other day when I followed you, I was like, wait a minute. I swear I was following everybody. So I just like hopefully quietly followed. Because <laughs> I didn't realize I wasn't. I'm so bad. I'm so bad at TikTok when it comes to like doing anything other than scrolling through the timeline or whatever you want to call that thing. Lloyd, we're having a moment. Okay. Can we? Oh, wait. Is it too late for that? <gasps> we can. Oh, my goodness. Are we going to have time to get over there? Yes. Let's go right on the hot air balloon. I've never, ever got to see it yet. It must be like a this time of night thing. Excuse me. I'm cutting through the farms. Hold on. I'm out of time. Crunch here. Oh no. Lloyd is out of energy. Trigger. 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 Shall we ride the hot air balloon? Yes. I've never got to see this. Please select a route. To the tree farm, to the city of Portia, to the collapsed wasteland, to the WoW industries industries to the Eufaula Desert. I really don't know. So let's go to the Eufaula Desert. I don't actually remember where that is. <laughs> did Brad tell you about the inappropriate thing I made him watch on Discord? He did not. It made, me, it made him watch me blow a raspberry on Curry's belly. <laughs> oh, that time was so cute. <laughs> Brad, why didn't you tell me that? Oh my gosh, so how freaking adorable. My cat would scratch my eyes out. <gasps> oh, look how pretty this is. Yo. I'm glad I took this route. Look at Portia. I don't know where we're going. I don't even know if my llama came with me. Breathtaking. Wow, I picked a really long route. <laughs> but I'm glad I took this 
this route because it is very pretty. You can hit, you can kind of see the entire city as well as like everything off in the distance that maybe I haven't discovered yet. I love it. I'll keep it right here. It's so beautiful. Uh, Elfie would kill me in my sleep if I tried that on her. Curry is chill. I can almost do anything to him and he doesn't care. I like cats like that. <laughs> I like cats who will not scratch your eyes out at every possible moment. My cat would probably let me do it for like two seconds, but then she would scratch my eyes out. She's a little more tolerable to, you know, anything. Like she'll let you mess with her and stuff for funsies, but she is also, she will scratch your eyes out at the same time if she's not in the mood. Ooh, uh, September 16th, something you need to be here. It's the National Muscadine, Muscadine, as I said that, festival, tons of carny games and stuff, and hot air balloon rides. I don't know if I could ever really go on a hot air balloon ride, if I'm being completely honest, but <laughs> that sounds fun, though. I literally picked the f I, I, This is the longest air balloon ride ever! I literally picked a super long route. It's okay. It's all right. Hello, Ray Ray. Thank you so much for feeding Sally here for my tax. I appreciate that. So does she. How are you doing today? As long as nobody is yelling or trying to hurt him, he is chill. Oh, yelling scares Curry because of the abuse he suffered as a kitten. Understandable. Totally understandable. This is pretty though. We have we have a woman well, one of my parents' cats is very skittish because we found him, so I don't you know want to take a selfie? Sure. This is not a selfie. This is the back of us. And I can't rotate to the front. <laughs> but anyways, as I was saying. Uh, we have a cat in our house who's very skittish to... I don't, nothing in particular, just skittish, but we found him. So I don't know what he went through before I found him. So he can be very skittish at times. Good enough? Well, didn't really let me take a picture very well there. Oh, and put our boot at plus three. Let's go. But my cat, she's been through a lot, like the last five years. So certain things will really get her upset. Like she's normally like a pretty brave cat and all that, but there are some things that'll happen and she freaks out because I, I believe she has PTSD as well. Well, I kinda needed to end stream. I didn't expect this balloon ride to be this long. It's okay, though. It's okay. I'll see you later. Oh. Uh, I've never been on my, never been on one myself, but if you wanted to ride, I would put on my big girl panties and hang on. Oh my god. It would take a lot for me to try and do that, but you know what? At the same time, things like hot air balloons and things like that, they are things like I wish... I could pull myself to do to say I experienced it. You know what I mean? Thank you, Brad, for giving Ray Ray a shout out. I can't skip this either. Like I like this pretty. Yes. Oh, it's thank like, God. Feels like we wasted a lot of time. We rode in a balloon for like an hour. Oh my God, that made the date end. Could I have pushed something to cancel that? I pushed spacebar just there. And I don't know if that triggered it or if it was because the date actually ended. Oh well. Oh well. Oh, I can't jump anymore. I'm out of stamina. That took way too long. I hope that... I hope that me pushing spacebar was me actually canceling the action, but I don't know. Um, I'm going to make these earmuffs really quick before I go to bed. Hopefully the game doesn't get mad at me. I will have.
have them in my inventory for when we come back. And then I will do everything else when we come back as well. Because I need to go fix dinner because I'm supposed to be fixing dinner for the fam tonight. So. All right. Love you guys. See you later. Okay. So that is it for me today. Sorry, I'm going to be like abruptly end here, but I do need to get off. That date was so long. That date was so long. Tons of stuff here. I, oh, I know you would like and stuff. It sounds like it. It does. We have some things here, but I, I'm not very social with people who are around me. Like, just the town itself. Like, I'm always afraid I'm going to run into somebody I know that I don't want to run into. So I don't go out in my town very often for that fact. I'm always afraid I'm going to run into that one person I do not want to see. So, yes. <laughs> Bye! I'm so sorry you came in late, but I'm leaving. But thank you so much, Ray Ray, for being here. And you are very welcome for the shout out as well. Um, but that is it for me. I do need to get off because I do need to make dinner for my family. But I just want to say thank you so much to everyone who was here today. I really appreciate all your love and support. And I forgot to say this, but you guys freaking smashed my sub goal again. I have to bump it back up a little bit so that there is a goal there but i appreciate all the love and support from all of you guys it's never necessary but i appreciate it beyond words like i never really know what to say i usually am a babbling fool but i really do appreciate it all and i really had a good time between that little lull we had in the game where we talked about things again you guys know i love sitting here and chatting with you guys and letting out all of those I don't want to say it was it's emotions I guess it would be a good way to call it but it was it's always nice to sit down and just kind of talk about things sometimes and just open up and, and understand that we all go through things and at the end of the day when it comes to games it's just a game it's when it comes to life we don't know what people are going through on the other side so just always try and be kind to everyone no matter what because sometimes life can be tough for someone and you may trigger something really bad to that person by something you say so it's just so, try to always remember that. And I know everyone in my chat does know that, but I'm just saying, in general, just think about what the other person may be going on on the other side of that screen. But that is it for me today. I thank you guys again so much for everything. You guys are so amazing. We are gonna go find someone to raid. I will be there for probably just a few seconds. I do really literally have to raid and run today, but we have to go show the love, we do. Uh, like if it was in your town, that would be the clown of the town, but here I sit in the hole and shake. I know that feeling, yes. I don't like going into my town because I don't want to see certain people. Because I don't like them. <laughs> or they were not good in my life and I don't want them in my life anymore and I don't want to run into them. You know that feeling? I never did get my food! Pepperoni pizza and a bowl of baked beans. You know what, let's see what I'm having for dinner. I know what I'm making for dinner. Well, what's the bot think I'm getting? Avocado toast with a bowl of jello. Take it. I take it for sure. I want that. Um, let me exit out of my game. I will have that for dinner. That's not what I'm having. I'm making something new tonight. Don't know if it's going to come out good. I am making for dinner. Put that up. It's called Sloppy Joe Corned Beef. Or no, Corned Beef. Cornbread Dinner. It's like cornbread on the bottom with sloppy joe mixture on top. So I'm gonna see if it comes out good. I hope so. But that is what I'm literally making for dinner tonight. And I have to go make the cornbread and everything. So I got lots to do. I gotta make that. I gotta make the cornbread and I also gotta make the sloppy joe mixture. Um, Let's see who is on right now. Okay, all right. Trying to decide who to raid. We've got a couple options. Oh my gosh, it gives me a hiccup. Never had avocado toast look scary. Avocado toast looks scary? It's good. I don't have it as toast. I have it as just plain bread. Literally, bread, avocado on, to on top. I love it. I could eat avocado frickin' all day long. Trying to decide who to raid. I've got a couple options. A couple of them we've raided like within the last week, so I like to try and spread it out. This person, let's see. 
I gotta go through an ad, just one sec. They started two minutes ago. But we haven't raided them in a while, so let me see if... If they have a starting soon screen, or if they're literally on already. I hope I can make good cornbread, I'm just saying. I haven't made cornbread in frickin' years. And I hope it comes out good, because I love me some cornbread, too. And I'm making it from scratch. Well, this person is currently in the starting soon screen, but I kind of want to leave you guys with them. So it might be a second until we can say hello properly because he's currently not on camera, but I still kind of want to raid into their channel. So we're going to do that. By the time I get the raid going and everything, they might actually be there too. I mean, not there, but be really live on camera and all that stuff. But well, we are going to go right into True Motivation if you don't know who this is. Amazing person. Amazing supporter. We love them. They're playing Dead by Daylight today. They do play with friends, so I'm assuming that's probably what they're going to be doing today. Every time I've popped in on their stream, they're usually playing Survivor with friends. So if you want to play with them, I believe he has open lobbies as well. He is currently in the starting soon screen, so it might be a second before he says hello and everything, but it's okay. I still want to go over and give him the support because it's been a while since we've raided into his stream. Uh, if you are subbed to the channel, please show all the Skelly Town love with the second set of raid command that Brad put in there for us. If you are not, the first one works perfectly fine and shows the same amount of love. It wouldn't let me raid you with your channel. <laughs> That's okay, Brad. It's all good. Thank you for the stream. Thank you. Thank you to everyone who's there. Again, really quickly, I will put this in here. I can do it fast. Oh, he's he's live. Perfect timing. Uh, Discord is open. If you guys want to join me there, I'm on there. Off stream, hanging out. If you guys want to join it, it's open. I hope you guys enjoy it. I will be back on Monday with some Dead by Daylight. And the raid is about to leave. He just got here. He is no longer on the starting soon screen, so we can say hello properly. Let's go give all that love to True Motivation, and I will see you guys on Monday. Bye-bye!